No. Oh, okay. I got like, <laughs> I got scared a little bit. For, for a business, it's like invalid PB. Yeah, that would be such an anti-climactic thing. Okay, Insomnia, just uh, DM me in the Discord your prediction and I'll count it if it's, if it's like close. It's, it's all right. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's go. Спасибо, Синяш. Спокойной ночи. Okay, have fun. Yeah, and uh, bye, Fabio, as well. No, Jenka, I haven't submitted. Who am I, stupid? <laughs> I see a lot of 314. People really believe in me breaking a minute barrier. Wow. I'm so grateful. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> we're gonna start. Oh my god, this perfect nail slashes to the music. The best beginning of the run, for sure. <laughs> and um, usually when I play longer categories, I have a rule chat. I never reset uh, unless I die. Even if I lose 20 seconds going into like Sanctum, unless I actually die, I don't really reset. Or, you know, I forgot to enable like pause button, remap or something like technical like that. I pretty much never reset the run. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, chat. My PB time is absolutely unpredictable. But this King Pass was all right, you know. Mid 57 is fine. It's not like Zuibel uh, tier King's Pass, but we take those. I'm doing that for sure categories as well, Jenka, unless I'm losing like 10 seconds. Probably in all skills, if I lose like 10 seconds to... To like, in, in King's Pass, like dunk into spikes, I will probably reset. Absurd that. Yeah, you see, 116 is, is a very good uh, Fury time. <clears throat> Mouse quit out, of course. Fun fact chat. Uh, <laughs> for mouse quit outs, I'm using a... I'm using like a visual cue. There's like a dirt spot on my monitor that I'm using as a visual cue. And <laughs> when I'll clean my monitor, I'll use this dirt spot and we'll start messing up mouse quit outs or we'll have to find another one. <laughs> Because like the, the dirt spot, like the spot is, is right on the cut out button. <laughs> I'm kind of fucked already. I'm just not cleaning my monitor and listen, I can't see. <laughs> Task yet. Dirt assisted speed run. I'm gonna put some dirt in your eyes. Oh yeah, um, I was completely distracted in the early game. So wh while nothing is going on, um, why why I do runs offline anyway, right? Oh my god, <laughs> I used a fucking double spike on current patch. <laughs> yeah, I mean this is my rule. I never reset. I do I don't reset that. No. I'm, I'm not. I'm not resetting. I'm not resetting vengeful spirits. <laughs> Fuck resetting the early game. So yeah. Uh, why I do runs offline anyway? Sometimes you know I had this mood that I'm kind of wanna play in the game, but I don't really want to commit to the grind. And at the same time, I don't really feel like interacting with the chat. I don't really feel like streaming. So when something like that happens, when I'm in such a mood. Uh, what I'm doing is I usually start up the game and I give myself 20 minutes to, give, to get a run going. If I don't get a run in 20 minutes, I just move on with my day. And if I get a run, well, this happens. So this is usually how I do runs offline. Or sometimes when I'm really desperate for PB, I will start doing offline runs. Because I really need focus. 
this wasn't I really need focus day. This is just I kind of didn't didn't really want to grind, but I kind of wanted to try, but I didn't want to stream. So yeah. Don't take it personal, chat. Don't take it too personal. By the way, seek damage tank. Wow. Oh yeah, for those who just joined, I have a channel rewards for PB prediction. And if you get within 40 seconds without going faster, you'll get a gift sub. 81 guesses. Well, I do like 10, or maybe if I feel... Uh, I give 10 subs, maybe if I feel generous. Or super hyped, I might gift more. We'll see. We'll see if, if I'm feeling Bezos. Fun fact, I almost started to slash the gate because I watch Kuro Kuroshi too much and uh, he's running all skills. <laughs> Come on, if I would have PB'd by 10 seconds, I would have just posted the splits. Wow, you have no faith in me. <laughs> Whoops. Fucked up the jump. But if I if I beat by one second only, <laughs> so yeah, that was kind of shit, vengeful spirit. You've seen it all yourself. But since I saved so much time on Fury, it's still like five or four. So yeah. pretty good, pretty good, you know. <laughs> Yeah, actually, I've done the entire run on an exercise ball, Wazanki. I've done an entire run, like, four hours on this ball. And my, my back muscles are so sore because of that. I actually feel them. <laughs> but I'm kind of enjoying the pain. Oh, Shana! Hello, thanks for the raid. Yes. Thanks for the good luck. Good luck on uh, reacting to my own run. Nothing really is going on in this mount so far. I guess I fucked up the double plank, but who cares? This is like 112. Nobody gives a shit about your early game in 1xx. <laughs> Thanks, Alex. Like, um, you can take Scrafy as an example. He has insane fucking 106 time, but. I mean, I've seen paces that are 30 seconds faster after dive. So, like, who cares? It's the, the run is three hours. Nobody gives a fuck about 30 seconds at the beginning. <laughs> serpent erasure. Why would I erase serpent? <laughs> what the fuck is happening? <laughs> I couldn't jump here, but chat, I'm not resetting. <laughs> oh lol. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that's a disaster. <laughs> you shouldn't have believed in 312, well. Yeah, Scrafy never fails to deliver, like... You, you always know that PB is gonna be eventful. <laughs> and very fast. And like, ahead of its time. Ah, I didn't get the gamer birds, might as well reset. Look, the G was 3 well, 311, wink wink, nudge nudge. Huh? World record is uh, 3.11.28. <laughs> is this a foreshadowing? <coughs> um, yeah, it's very good, Jenker. It's actually, it can be, like, the early game can be faster for sure. So it's not, like, he's never gonna get this time again. It's still very improvable, like sub 1720 is definitely possible on like high level early game. So for example, if Axe Q would you know, run 112, he would be getting sub 1720 for sure. <laughs> hey Mathulu, nice prediction. Yeah. <laughs> to 
the fuck is happening in this green path? But chat, I'm not resetting. I'm playing a lot of jumps because, you know, I'm kind of like, in the mood when I don't know where this run is gonna go. So I'm, I'm giving myself some slack at the beginning. <laughs> I'm sitting like on a feed ball here. Yeah. So sorry if this like distracts you. I got uh, the double fireball, by the way. Will he fuck up the Vengeful King? Will he do this? I mean, of course not. I'm 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 good at the game. I'm good at the game. I would never do this. <laughs> I'm super excited. Kind of fucked up this jump as well. This this uh, green pad is a total disaster. Not gonna lie. But I have a lot of Geo. I have a lot of Geo. Valley go bounce. <laughs> yeah, my back is super sore because I I've done the entire 112 run on this on this ball. <laughs> bounce. Uh, it was yesterday offline, Mathulu. I'm I'm not running it right now. <laughs> I'm just uh, watching it. Oh, nice double. And I woke her up. That was a very good strat. That was kind of good as well. I'm kind of playing well. For the, for the pattern, for the pattern, that's a, that's a nice fight. Ah, yeah, it was yesterday. So, you see, we're seven seconds ahead. This is, by the way, this is like, this is 13 seconds slower than my best pace ever. <laughs> Oh, by the way, my new cup, look at that. It's an art from my channel. My wife did me, made me a new cup. It's like a sleepy night with a cup of uh, hot beverage on one side and kind of quirrell, like drunk on chocolate. Any valley go drunk emotes? <laughs> but yeah, look at this close strats. Oh my god. I always do two dashes into the wall because I can't like give a shit about anything more optimal. Nail boosts, leave it to all skills runners. I don't give a fuck. Look at this nail cancels. Look at this nail cancels. Oh my god, so good. And a free soul from the shroom. Not gonna lie, 101 exit is is like 106 tier. No foolish HP fury. Yeah, what is this? By the way, for those of you who don't know, it's not it, it is not possible to get full HP fury on the latest patch that I'm playing on. Oops, bonked. <laughs> Bounce into the beat of the dash. Will he get explosion pogo? And also, what strat will he go for? <laughs> Recently, uh, a runner named Cooper uh, dropped a new variation of one fireball, and I'm gonna try it now. You see two dashes? It's it's very good. I I like it. Like this is this is one laugh now. I'm 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 doing the strat from now on. I like it a lot. Cooper, I love you. <laughs> and of of course, I mean of course it's this is double dash. Whoever gonna fail it, not me for sure. And a gold by a fucking second. <laughs> this is comes up by the way. I will upload it to the sheet later. It's still improvable by like two seconds or something, but you know. This is a start. <laughs> this is kind of a like, weird movement here. Yeah, you see, I, I started learning more like zoomer movement, like for example, right side strat here. But I, I fucked up like a half of it. Yeah, I think I'm not gonna go for the right strat or this uh, on the grab room because I'm not consistent at it yet. 
So I'm going for the regular left side. Like, yeah. Like, whatever else are doing. <laughs> kind of fucked up this dash. <laughs> what is this movement? But yeah. This is kind of bad, but I will revisit Fungal Waste at some point. <laughs> Stop. Uh, the mushrooms are betraying me. I'm like bonking. <laughs> I mean, people gonna get, uh, people are gonna get, you know, gonna get guesses anyway. I'll just uh, cut it off in the chain queue. I'll start from the first one, and as soon as I don't feel like gifting subs anymore, I'll just stop. So I'll just kind of let people guess whatever. Eternal glory is a reward on its own too, you know. <laughs> so yeah, pretty uneventful city so far, nothing like happens. This movement is pretty consistent, unless you do some fuck-ups like here. I missed a wall grab, so I have to hard fall, unfortunately. That's like a rookie mistake to make, but I do it sometimes. Uh, although I wall grabbed here for no reason at all. Hey, Spirity, what's up? Welcome. Yeah, I, I wanted to skip, but unfortunately he was a bit far away, so I didn't do the skip. So yeah, the regular strat here. You can't always go for it, unfortunately. Here we get a little bit of an Ori control. And Pogo the Jennifer. No falling down, you know. Good Pogo here, right into the transition. And optimal Lemash is... <laughs> Unfortunate uh, HP loss, but it's kind of tight to get that pogo. When he does that, you just, yeah, up slash him once and kind of wait for the attack wind up and then you can safely slash the gate. If, if I had 3 HP here, I always just heal to 4. So 4 HP is the minimum amount that I'm, uh, I'm going to Sanctum with, because 3 HP is kind of eh, 4 HP is livable. Got old Geo and... As usual, it, it's impossible to time this gate. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely impossible. Went the bottom road yet because they kind of all went top. He kind of decided to, to troll me, but uh, you know, I just took the time loss, so I don't get, uh, so I don't lose HP. <clears throat> I think this fight will be a disaster. Yeah, no doubles, and I'm kind of messing up a little bit. Yeah, I'm playing it really safely, and I still dashed like once into him, because at the end I got impatient here, so I'm healing one more time. 4 HP is very comfortable, like, spot here. I, I like being at 4 HP here. 1.5 elevators moment. And oh, barely dodged that. I just, like, barely squeezed there. Very good. No, we don't finish the journal. I prepared to pogo, but, you know, that's good damage tank. Nice hell rule. Definitely, I, I well played it. I did one mistake, but overall, yeah. Yep, good. I'm already at enough geo. I think I fucked up the early control, maybe not, I don't know. Yeah, I, I definitely, I think, yeah, I think I'm like kind of hesitated. I was hesitating here whether, whether I'm going for Fury or not. <laughs> and I missed the fireball, epic. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, he, he will be teleporting a lot, so I'm gonna lose some time here. I'll just throw you the fight. It doesn't really have any close calls, you know, just, just, just very annoying pattern. So you see a lot of teleports, a lot of dives. Basically just like a 
time loss pattern, nothing you really can do about. And it's very unfortunate because he like teleports and when you're barely reaching him, he can start a dive, so you have to hesitate on your movement. Well, if you wanna get the rug going, anyway. Oh yeah, I'm, I've started off here, so I'm missing hits. I'm trying to adjust, and he immediately stops diving. I missed two hits. <laughs> hey, damn. So yeah, we lost time, but I mean 17.48 is uh, what, uh, it's 22 seconds slower, it's 22 seconds slower than blue early game today. <laughs> yep, gonna get hit here, but I have the soul. Will you get a fake dive? I mean, of course, it's 1.5. Fake dives always work here. Two HP into storerooms, Monka S. Okay, Junker, I, I'll, I'll try not to throw and not to cheat. But yeah, I'm having like a comfortable amount of HP, of soul, just barely, so I decided that I won't heal, because again, I'm not really committing to the grind today, on, on that night, I just wanna start a run and see how it goes, so I wasn't like too attached to this early game, because it's not that good anyway, it's 20 seconds slower than my best pace ever, and 24 seconds slower than whatever blue got today, so it's not that, it's not like the run is insane, it's just, you know, your kind of average, whatever pace, that you feel kind of nothing about. Yeah, you can, Gustin. So yeah, very consistent storerooms, I didn't do a single mistake here. I kind of played it on a safe side, on the, on the safe side because you know 2 HP can spiral out of control very soon. And here we are, 20 seconds ahead. Nice insta bell, by the way. <clears throat> I mean, you can just you know rewatch the beginning of Zank. I often do it when I'm pace paling and see like half of the run. Uh, then I'll just you know look at the first half and. Accept the run. Oh, got hit. Sometimes this finch fly hits me when it's too high. I'm I'm on the uh, feet ball Mars. Hi. This is my chair now. <laughs> Just gotta remove my seconds. I like poking him on the side because he fall faster. So you don't pogo his head, he kinda pogo his side. Because it's lower. And Junker doesn't even hear he's not even here to record this point one of a time save. Ay ay ay. Oh my god, the heart fall. Rip time time save. <laughs> I'm already like at <laughs> Yes, purity kind of. I'm on the ball. Yeah, hard fall, better reset. I'm not going for Pogax, chat. I'm just going around. Got a bit of an unfortunate pattern and missed an up slash, so very unoptimal here. Bad movement. But it's fine. I rarely miss uh, this spike tunnel that I'm usually very consistent. Hey, Kuroshi. <laughs> Just bounce and bounce, 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 bounce. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I got hit here because I fucked up the movement at the very beginning. So I just fucked it up at the start. 
Yeah, my early game in this round wasn't the greatest because, I mean, as you remember, my mood for running wasn't like super focused. It was kind of laid back. So I gave myself a lot of slack in the early game. Also, I knew that my PB early game at the time wasn't great either, and I'm already 20 seconds ahead. So just whatever. Just just let me through the early game. I don't care. The chat, the worst thing you can do when you run alone categories is caring about your pace early into the run. Also nice inventory drop. I fucking nailed that shit. Frame perfect, let's go. Two in a row. <laughs> Easy. Two frame perfect inputs in a row. Valley go easy in the chat, motherfucker. But yeah, uh, heatless uh, cycle here. <laughs> easy clap here. Yeah. I'm on a ball gauge. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, here it is. Do you see this? Can you see the ball? I'm sitting on that little boy. Yeah, I'm sitting on that bad boy. It's, it's like purple. It's also very hot here, because my run is so hot. <laughs> I bogged the crystal for the one Geo. <laughs> I know I'm just feeling like a PM. I have a gaming chair like besides me. Like here it is. Like here it is. It's, I don't know if you can even like, see it. But yeah. I have a chair kind of behind my back. But I'm not really feeling it. This is just like a regular... Unfortunately, I bonked here. So I decided to... Be like... No! Uh, 3.04 is... Uh, my best possible times. Yeah. 15 Celsius? No, it's, it's colder. It's like something minus. It's really... It's maybe it's like minus 15. <laughs> like regular, regular, regular dark room, nothing special. Oh, damn bricks, that's cool. Oh, you can you can look at the channel rewards, can you? Or have you like just collected everything from the chat? Oh, I mean, if you want, I can make you a mod, if you're up to. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like, no, no pressure. I think it worked. And yeah, by the way, buggy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, Crystal Hunter fucking stuck. So. <coughs> and I missed it. Yeah, Crystal Crystal Hunter. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's a bit sto stoned PM. Unfortunately, Crystal Hunter got stuck, so I lost 10 seconds here. You're really losing 10 seconds when you're not getting the early control. So yeah, rip. Ah, look at DMs afterwards. <laughs> so yeah, yeah, like the believers in really, really optimal PVs are probably shaking right now. I'm just minus 10. I had a pace, chat, I had a pace that was 40 fucking seconds ahead here. Not my, not 11 seconds. Just for the comparison. Also optimal sketch jump. Uh, channel reward spirit to guess a PB time without going over, without going faster. <laughs> like you can uh, redeem, yeah, you can redeem, uh, redeem the time. So we we'll see you in the queue later. <laughs> ah. 
regular dream plots really like the early game oh look at the wall grab this wall grab is actually optimal you don't need to dash at the end if you wall grab you reset your heart fall oh and i got an inventory drop that's so good Yeah, I, I installed a bit late, but I'm fine with taking damage here when I have lot, lots of HP. It's really it's really easy to get hit here, but, you know, when you have HP, there's no reason to not go for it. Since you're quitting out here regardless. Uh, I don't know what's the timing so static. I just kind of press C dash and it works. If it, If you go too early, you can press it again. It's like not something you can mess up ever, so I don't even care about the timing. Yeah. <laughs> now we're going to Salubra to buy a Shaman Stone and a Charm Notch. And our final goal is Elegant Key. The minimal amount of Geo you want here is 1090. So I have 23 extra Geo. Which is actually quite rare. Usually you just barely have enough. <laughs> hey monster, thanks a lot. Oh, 13. Okay, I mean, I'm bad at math. So, at, at basic everything kicks. Well, I guess I'm bad at any math, but still. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, this split is actually quite kind of good. This split is actually decent. It's not uh, it's not gold pace, I think, because I, I did kind of kind of couple movement mess ups. I got hit and creeped. It loses time to like, you know, getting knocked back and all that. So I don't think it's gonna gold, but it will be very close to gold anyway. I know Violet. It's hard to say. Yeah, half a second. If I haven't gotten hit by the entombed task, that would have been a gold. <laughs> Hitting the bell and equipping this one charm in another one and kind of going to storerooms to fight a fucking soul warrior. Chat, I hate soul warriors. Soul warriors are my uh, my deadly enemies. <laughs> Boom. I didn't go for like C dash elevator Guston because I haven't practiced it. I kind of kind of wanted to hit the lever but decided against it. I hate when Crystal when the Dark only does one kick of damage here. And here I missed the, an entire spell, started going for vengeful spirits because I hate soul warriors. And I lose patience very quickly with them. I think Soul Warrior part is my worst part in like true ending run. I always lose in like 10 seconds to I know count sobs on Soul Warriors. <laughs> they are just my greatest enemies. Even though I kinda practice them a lot, I, I still suck. But it's okay. One day I'll become good. It's just a matter of practice. Hey Buck, thanks for the congrats. So yeah, just regular C-dash here, no elevators. 4 HP is very comfortable amount here, because we don't go for Ismas tier. I fucked up the nail cancel. <laughs> Here's some movement I'm going for. Just for the sake of soul collection. 
It's not the fastest strat for this guy, but it gives a lot of soul. So you don't have to spend time to hit, you know, flip flops and other guys in water race. Venomy Arcred. Gotcha. Venomy <laughs> I like your hive, time saver still, and uh, the one to open a gut home entrance, gut home shortcut. <clears throat> so far this is a very good split. I have a lot of soul, uh, didn't get hit once. I'm not going f for the second hit, uh, instead I'm hitting this, like, whatever this guy's flip-flop or whatever. I'm hitting him. Here I sort of could have just pogoed him and went over, but when you flip him uh, upwards, he decides to, like, jump. So I decided not to risk it and to go safe about it. Could have saved like another second on top of it. Didn't get that dash. Pin flip into security. This is just like a normal quick kill. Will I get it? It's a little bit tight, but it's kinda consistent. One, two, the dark. Like then I do three. And another like yeah, I do three just in case he does that. Okay. Very consistent. Very nicely executed for the pattern. You can technically squeeze in one more like one more nail hit before the second D dark, but if you do it just a bit too slow, you will reset his stagger count. So I'm not going for it. It can save you like another half a second or something. This is this is a goal. Very cool. We're 20 seconds ahead again. PB that I'm running against is 3 hours 15 minutes. Yeah, it's a comes up. I mean, it's also a new split, kind of. Oh, wait, is it is it comes up? Um, you can actually check if it's a comes up or not on the sheets because I have recorded monsters time. Like, combined... Uh, like, com combined Dunk Defender kill plus time to get uh, the King's Idol. I've added up like, monsters time there. Yeah. Uh, you can type exclamation mark gold sound, Aaron, as a single word. Yeah, it's like half filled. Yeah, Jennifer, I'm still going. <laughs> I think it's like... I, I missed what RNG on the bridge I've gotten. But look at the Geo chat. The Geo is absolutely lit. <laughs> <laughs> and I got hit here. Uh, luckily, when you get hit by this guy, it's actually it's complete RNG whether you get hit or not. Uh, it's not that bad because you st need to stop your crystal dash anyway. I'm actually just debating to drop this crystal dash at all on this guy because it doesn't... It really doesn't matter. Since you need to go for the key regardless. Of course I do the first try basin skip. Who am I? A loser? <laughs> kind of fast clear. clear. <laughs> Aaron is just the guy who asks a cop to be very fast. <laughs> In a rude manner. Yeah, it's slow because I yeah I got the bad RNG on the bridge, but execution-wise it was all right. <laughs> Thanks, uh, Magpie. Yeah, I'm not doing save quit here. I mean, it saves less than a second, and I don't really like uh, splits. 
So like I don't really like uh, stuff that PB is only that saves time only because of the timer abuse, you know. Not my favorite thing. <laughs> also, quit outs are very flashy. I don't like them in a route that much. So if it saves less than a second, I'm not going for it. I just don't care. If it if if it saved like four seconds, I would do it. For like two seconds. Uh, you still get the sap, uh, Dre Wolf. Yeah, don't worry about it. Like, if if you happen to get the sap, you will see the notifications later. This fight was all right. Nothing, you know, nothing out of this world. But also, I didn't throw so. Whatever we take those. So far this pace is, you know, it's it's okay. It's it's nothing like out of this world. You can't say that it's insane pace. It's just, you know, hang hanging there. <laughs> I had faster. I had faster paces for sure. I'm also not going for a faster fa for the faster strat on this grab because it's a bit risky. You can kind of get hit by the spikes. I'm just doing easy strats. <laughs> we'll see, Blue Phoenix. We'll see. We'll see. Um, put down my webcam a little bit. <laughs> I missed uh, missed the bell. Yeah, I mean for real. I wouldn't I wouldn't do this for one second. It's it's a bit too much hype for one second. Like bobbing someone by one second, that was fun. But you know, hyping up about NPD if it's just one second. <laughs> oh, I got hit and I, and I fell down. Like what the fuck is this chat? <laughs> I have never done this mistake before actually and and I go the wrong side ah. it's like help <laughs> nice focus on the little guys by the way and hatchlings I hate hatchlings here they're so annoying so I'm trying to kill as much of them as I can before this door opens. I, th I think I'm still gonna get hit. <laughs> Look at that. I'm at 2 HP. If that explodey guy gets me, I'll die, chat. We can get all the way down without dashing. I'm just not very good. Will he die? I mean, of course I'm not dying here. Who am I? I mean, of course, um, I'm killing this maggot for Geo. It's very important what to Geo. It's essential to the route. So you just can't avoid this. I would like to spare him, but it's impossible. Oh, just barely clutched that. Shade Soul, of course. I'm always going for Shade Soul. It's a lot of DPS. And since you... Oh, this that was kind of scam because those rocks should have hit him. But I think those rocks got cancelled. <laughs> Still, I mean, kind of decent first phase. Apart from that one hit, it, it went really well. Oops. <clears throat> um, perfect execution on the on the triples. Obligatory hit into the maze. <laughs> I'm not going for any sketchy strats here, so Serpent, if you're here, I'm sorry, but no, I don't need this time save. <laughs> Maybe in training though. Maybe if I get back to training, I will do it. I will, I will do the sketch kill. 
<laughs> it has to be done. <clears throat> <laughs> now we're going to get Cyclone Slash. I think this is like the last place before Gate and Dream Gate where you can die and lose like two minutes. I think after Johnny's Blessings you can just take a Dream Nail and do like a chill no reset. So usually this is the part when I'm kind of careful, when I'm trying to be really careful. Like this the last part pre Dream, Nail, pre -dream Gate. And I guess I consider it to be, you know, the, the final nail to the coffin of the early game. If 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 it makes sense. So like Gate and Dream Gate is where you actually enter like the next section of the game. Because I mean you can break down 112 in multiple parts, but um, This is how I like to think about it. Yeah, he got stuck, Jankar, I'm sorry. It's kind of my fault that he got stuck because he got stuck under under the big crystal and it's totally avoidable. I should just you know kind of see where he's going and do like a little manip, but I didn't pay attention, so it's kind of just you know a lesson. <laughs> I don't need wings there, Spirity. Wings are a social construct, also here's my wings. Oh yeah, eventually I decided to be really slow here for some reason. Usually he's already here hitting me and he was really slow, so I'm losing some time here. I'm still saving time like, uh, against the old trot, but sometimes eventually I decide to dip. That's fine. Yeah, yeah, I baited him really low. Maybe, ah, I think I jumped when he started to move down. I should have waited, probably. But yeah, this is a good strat. Still saving time. I uh, released my cycle a bit too slow. Here. <laughs> Yeah, this is that was bad. Oh. I haven't written anything yet, Riggs. I don't really need to practice anything this early. Of course, perfect wiggles. I mean, my wiggles are always perfect. <laughs> Thanks, Blue Phoenix. Shit. Will he fuck up Dark Johnny's? Good start. Good second part. <laughs> oh god. That was almost fuck up. <laughs> yeah, good night, Junk. Uh, good night, Serpent. Yeah. Cheers. And the wiggle. Woo! Nice. Uh, save the second to gore early control, but we're 40 seconds ahead, chat. <laughs> My best pace ever was a minute ahead here, so it's like 20 seconds slower. Thing. I, I know like I know for a fact that my movement strats aren't the best for some segments. For example, I don't have the most optimal cyclone movement here. Like I kind of forgot what to do. So I'm doing something close to good but not the best. Uh, and I know that like the best strat will save me like a second and a half, right? I also know that like journeys can be a little bit less sloppy and all that, but those are small time saves that I have low in my priority queue. 
So when, when I choose what to practice, I really try to concentrate on parts that don't feel good, you know? That I feel like the most annoyed about. Because I don't have that much time to practice. I can't just, you know, grind five hours a day, unfortunately. I usually have like an hour a day. And if I and it's if I like really try. If I really like go try hard. That that was nice, uh, zero by the way. I got too much soul. I should get like one one less uh <clears throat> I should have gotten one less hit on the soul totem. So yeah, I'll try to prioritize my practice in a way where I try to get the most time safe out of my practice. That's why I'm going so hard on Pantheons these days, because this is my weakest part. <laughs> yeah, I jumped for some reason here. It didn't have to happen, but it's like whatever. But sometimes, you know, the parts that you kind of get good at, uh, they then after some time of not practicing them on the Dune Demon runs, your skills at them degrade and you have to revisit them. Like for example, I, I will point out when the time when the time go goes. Or sometimes you do like big mistake on the part of the run, but you know that you just you know humans aren't perfect. You just did a mistake. You know that you can do the strat like nine out of ten. And this is just one out of ten mistake that you made, so I'm not feel that bad about them. Or for example, mistakes that you haven't done in a while. So I just skip those places in practice anyway. I don't know, it, it's weird, like, when you don't have a lot of time to practice, you just have to prioritize. Of course you can go extreme and just practice for two months without doing runs, but I know that for me personally that would be bad, because if I, <clears throat> if I don't do runs, Consistently, I start losing my uh, endurance and my consistency. So, like, I have to really mix uh, practice and runs. I think I need to do runs at least like twice a week to to stay. Look at that! <laughs> this elevator is so cursed. It actually have has like a very scuffed hitbox. <laughs> So yeah, this is like your uh, kind of adult with a life and family uh, complaining about uh, time limitation while also playing the game for four hours straight to get a run. Boo hoo! <laughs> that was a mimic. Even kind of clean and full double. <laughs> Like, gold is already not possible, because I got fucked by the elevator. But, you know, we can still get a good Zalian cycle. Or can we? And I fucked up at the very beginning, but I immediately kind of realized that I fucked up and just went for the backup. Kinda clean, if you ask me. Like, that's nice backup. Uh, so what happened is that I didn't grab the wall at the beginning, I didn't refresh my dash. It's a nice cyclone. And th this is like, you have to watch for it. You have to watch for that wall grab. If you didn't get a wall grab here, you just need to back off and jump on the platform. It's still a time save because in my PB I just botched that shit entirely. And look at that, I'm already 50 seconds ahead. Yeah, I thought I will kill him with two nail cancels. I absolutely miscounted. So now I'm at two hits before I die. Ay ay ay. I didn't have to dash here. It's just a bad habit that I do. So for example, I fucked up Zalian cycle here, but I rarely do this. So I don't really feel a need to practice. Like if I fail Zalian cycle like couple couple more times, I definitely will go and practice it. Oh, that was just... I just barely dodged that. <laughs> Went really safe on the fight. And no inventory slide, I'm sorry. It's slower anyway. 
<laughs> but I can skip this guy, so I saved some time here. <laughs> Jenka, my PP was a Giras no reset. This is a very good strat. If you, you see why it works. You start your crystal dash as left as possible, and crystal hunter have to get close to you before he shoots. That's why this crystal dash works. Look at this chat. This guy has two thousand hours in this game, and sometimes he still goes for input buffers out of crystal dash. What a loser! Somebody has called me a top runner. Like seriously, top runner would never buffer his input out of crystal dash in this game. Come on, that's like, such a rookie mistake to make. <laughs> crystal dash doesn't have input buffers. So you can't you, you can't press your button too early out after it. <laughs> And I still do this mistake, pressing, pressing input too early. See, that lost me like 5 seconds, yeah, exactly. Other than that, that split was really solid. Other than that, hazard respawn. And now we're getting into green path. I have a very specific strat here that's not uh, not technically optimal. You can get a little bit faster here, but you really need soul. So, for example, like this shades, uh, this cyclone is not the fastest movement you can get here, but you really need soul. You need at least six hits of soul. But I like going for seven in case I fuck up the Grimkin. So, so you see, in, in this short, sort of like long categories, I try to play on the safe side, like always. I rarely go for the sketchiest strat ever. So you see, I'm dashing here. Technically, you can just the, kind of jump over uh, these spikes. It, it, it would be faster, but the hitbox of thorns is, is very kind of tight here. So you see, I, I'm, I'm always going like on, on the safe side in the longer categories. There's really, really no reason to frame greed. It's kind of if you watch uh, Super Mario 64 speedruns. This is a gold here. It's just new split, so my gold here is not very optimal yet. It can be like a couple seconds faster, I think. Especially if you skip uh, on one hit of soul that they do, like an extra one. Uh, so if you watch SM64, you will notice that. Like 16 star runners go for the most optimal movement. Actually, you see, no heartfall here. This is actually an optimal strat. Let's go. But it's kind of free, so there is no reason to not go for it. Um, like you will see the most optimal movement in 16 star runs. Like next frame readers are 70 star runners, and other ones is like 120 star runners go for the safest strats. Uh, this is kind of a reroute time saves purity. Because I skip buying lantern here, that's why I'm saving 16 seconds, 16.9. Uh, so it, this time save will go away later. Don't worry about it. It's like a reroute thing. Of course, I should have, I shouldn't have hit this guy. I don't know why, what I was thinking. <laughs> Yeah, Gusten, exactly. That's a very good analogy. Oh, and I, yeah, I bonked here, unfortunately. So, green path is going on my practice list, by the way. Um, green path after, after uh, round. So, I even though it's like whatever, it doesn't lose that much time, one bonk, yes? But I, I felt shaky. You see, you see, this is like a, this is very little mistake. This is very small mistake. But I, I've noticed that I fucked it up a couple times. So uh, yeah, so I will I will go practice green path. Yes, spirit. I need full soul going into the next room. I'm not going for your stress that skip soul. <laughs> and I didn't trigger. I I just barely didn't trigger this guy. 
You see, I don't have full soul here, but I really need it. Because if you fail quick kill here, you will have to like fucking farm soul. <laughs> That's why I'm, I'm going on the safe side. Yes, I will lose like half a second to hit a soul totem, but I know that I'm safe for the next sprint. <laughs> And yeah, I, I went for the good good thing here, but I yeah I, I yeah yeah I still bonked, so like whatever. Yeah, I'm gonna practice green path, even though I didn't lose that much time, it still felt shaky. So I just need to go kind of lab it out a bit. <coughs> Wall jump. Well, jump wings. Dude. No, I, I've I've seen your strats. Yeah, you skip a you skip a you skip like a hit of soul, and unless you unless you mean on the way back. On the way back, there's better strats anyway, like that save time. So I will just practice them. Another the dark. You see, these guys are pra th these guys are training me. Uh, this is a reroute. So, uh, since my last PB, we rerouted this section, Princess Celery. That's why these splits don't have a comparison. And uh, the reroute converges at uh, Kingdom's Edge Entry. Yeah, so kinda soon. This moment is not very optimal too. So, like, technically, this Didark is not optimal, but Jennifer can fuck you up, you can get hit by the spikes if you're, like, a little bit slow. So, I don't know what I feel about it. Almost gold, by the way, because quick uh, Grimkin. Yeah, wall jump, wall jump, wings. Ah, uh, yeah, before, it's it's before Soul Totem, but I like, I like it more because it's very easy to do. Yeah. Like, there is no reason to change my strat here, really. Even if there's a difference, it's like 0.1. I'm not even sure that your strat is faster there. <laughs> so yeah, now we get the time loss back. So I saved 17 seconds. Actually, yeah, you see I've kind of checked out no crystal dash here, Junker. I think PC dash doesn't work. Since it's really like four dashes. You kind of have to jump because there's, you know, slow walk trigger, so I don't know about it. How much time does it save over my strat spirity? Like, it's kind of the same amount of movement, you know? Wall jump, wings, wall jump, wall jump, wall jump. Like, it's, it's the same amount of movement. <laughs> And the strat that I'm doing sets me up perfectly for the uh, Soul Totem Pogo. That's what I like about it. <laughs> this guy kind of lost me a little bit of time. And I did one extra... <laughs> so you see, I, I've lost 20 seconds here. So it's kind of a... you save, so you lose some time back. Like here, th this sucks. This really sucks. That's all wrong. This cyclone is all right, but before that, that was that was all really really bad. And here, like, oh my god, the bonk! Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I need to practice green path. This, you know, so this is not mistakes that I'm usually doing, but I really, you know, I felt shaky. I felt shaky during the green path, and this is a bad sign. Uh, I get Ismas before entering Kingdom's Edge Quad. Also, hi. Also, I'm technically not going for the fastest rates. You can start off. You can start off a bit faster. That's actually. That's actually. I want to learn. And I decided to hit this guy to not get hit and heal because lately no eyes were uh, rude to me. Um, before mount. Uh, Oh yeah, yeah. I just yes, Peter. Just as I said, I felt a bit shaky. That's why I did it. 
it's kind of my you know when I when I feel afraid I just do this up slash for no reason it's just my psychology I don't know why I think I used to do it earlier because I was always at low HP here and I just use it to heal so it's it's really just me not show, showing my unconfidence in my movement uh, yeah it's for stacks that's a fuck I <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? I just turned around for like no reason and lost. It's like what? Oh god. <laughs> that was a walking storage, wasn't it? <laughs> no, no, it's just a reroute, Shroomek. It will be fine soon. <laughs> Run invalid? Question <laughs> mark. Rip PB. Reject it, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I lost 10 seconds here. And this is my own mistake. I turned around accidentally. I just think I just smashed left for no reason. She, she would have died like 7 seconds sooner. Easily. This is, ju this is just a genuine mistake. And that's why Green Path goes on my practice list. Because I fucked it up a couple times already. I actually wrote it down. Fucked up inventory drop, but it's yeah, it's just, just gonna happen. Frame perfect input, can't get it every time. Almost smashed into this guy. <laughs> Oh, got hit, unfortunate, but that's fine. Yeah, I I don't need more soul here, spirited. But I need all the soul that I can get here. I know I technically don't need the soul, but I, I really need it myself. Like, I need the soul, because I know that it's gonna get short, like, for example, here. Like, yeah, you can skip this guy and save yourself, like, a second and a half. And I also, I only smash it two times, Spirit, yeah. Once when I'm going to, for, uh, Soul Eater. No, no, you're actually right, it's three times. Then for zero, and then here's the third time. So, yeah, three different times in a row. Yeah, you're, you're right. It's very good, Soul Totem. 3 HP, I'm not gonna bench. When I'm at 3 HP before going for Isma's tier, actually here is where we get Isma's tier. I'm not benching because Isma's tier is very consistent split. You really won't get hit more than once by getting formed. Also good time that we don't have to wait for the lever and to do like a look down strat. You can just go right away. It saves a bit of time. Because you're gonna smash the lever after saving quit. You see soul collection. Actually the soul collection is before Kingdom Sash. You don't really need soul for Horms, but you need soul later to kill a Grimkin. Yeah, Isma's tier is very, very comfortable. Uh, Dream Nail, uh, saving and quitting would be faster, but would Dream Nail preserve soul, you know? And we really need soul for Kingdom's Edge. Soul is actually very crucial part of this routing. A very important thing, you don't press accept here. If you press accept here, you're gonna uh, sync and uh, invalidate your run. So you're gonna accept uh, the Isma's pop-up when you actually can jump under that ledge. It's very easy to invalidate your run with this strat. Yeah, now we hit and bench. Like, optimally, you would not lose HP in the Vessel Arena, you will only get one damage and go to Kingdom's Edge at 4 HP without benching at all. But even if I'm at 4 HP, I'm always benching because fuck that. Yeah, I can sync my round teams. <laughs> Let's go, all's high. You see, I'm, I have a lot of soul, so this guy has no danger to me. I don't care about his RNG. Like, I don't have to double him or anything. I can just take my time. It's, it's very safe and consistent. 
with this much soul. Very nice. Like, late Ismas is absolutely goaded for 112. There's absolutely no reason to get it earlier. <coughs> Excuse me. And now the Hornet fight. Christ 107. Just learn shape of Unskips. Shaking my SMH. Uh, it's a relatively new route, uh, Garnix. It was like, what, a month? Or something. Like a month and a half. And that was like, I should have done this earlier to double. See, I, I practiced Hornet too, so I played it better than in my previous runs. That was a mistake, I shouldn't have done it. But she gives me like okay pattern. And I know that she's dead, so I'm going for the final the dark. Yeah, you make one room 1.3, yes, yes, the, the, the very last. By the way, that wall grab is actually good. <laughs> The one that I did. You don't have to like dash into the ceiling boost. You just grab that wall and you won't hard fall. I think you can like even charge the cyclone or something. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah, yeah, the, like the point three slower is the very final uh, room where you pogo the Durandus or Durandis. Double grab is very good. I've actually watched Gwonki practicing trending and he done it and I was wow that that will rock kind of kind of rocks. So you see I'm not just dismissing time saves like because I'm a boomer spirit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very conscious about my time losses. No, I'm not. Them zoomers have no respect. <laughs> I'm kind of going for the different strat here. Uh, so I do two cyclones into the dark here. So I don't have to farm soul for two descending darks. It wasn't like the cleanest execution, but it was alright. Here, I shouldn't really go for cyclone. I should go for uh, all skill strat, but... I don't know, I don't, I don't have Shade Cloak, don't fight me. I don't have Shade Cloak, I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> Blue doesn't even go for Boomer Strat Garnix. <laughs> he just goes for his own strats. <laughs> yeah, I was alright, Shade Cloak, could have been faster. I didn't need like one, sh one hit of salt there. That was alright. I mean, come on, Bloopy Beat. Celebrate. <laughs> Stop bullying, Blue. Hashtag love for Blue. <laughs> uh, so you don't have uh, to wait for the animation, uh, Nasir second. Shade, we're kind of in an annoying position, so I kind of went around here. Yeah, I fucked it up a little bit. I knew I will hard fall. <laughs> but it's still faster than Descending Dark. Even if you do it like that in a scout way, it's still faster. And spoiler alert, this is gonna gold. <laughs> uh. Oh yeah, I, I fuck up this early control. work <laughs> so much gold hey Colette <laughs> low <laughs> the 
Uh, you just kind of game lets you dream nail in the black screen. See, that surely control doesn't work, Spirit. At least I couldn't get it working. Uh, I'm in GMT plus 3. I'm branch. Like UTC plus 3, technically. So it's uh, 146, 145 in the morning for me. See, I couldn't get a single Velmy crystal dash here, unfortunately. Crystal dash would be so good. Catch Velmy Artrit. Velmy, Velmy Artrit. Velmy Helmet Delta. So I think not getting early control here loses like three seconds. Yeah. I'm getting a hit on the totem here, it's very fun. Get soul. And a couple of cyclone drops. Let's see the horn for RNG. The horn for RNG was good, let's go. Yeah, I just make crystal dash to go a bit earlier here because you can get RNG hit by these guys. What I like to do is like to do a shade soul into into pickup right away. <laughs> yeah, you get the soul garnix on current patch. I didn't crystal dash here because the flu can go out of bounds and hit you. I'm always dashing here, kind of. Unless I kill everything. Pretty jump lever, by the way. <laughs> A nice cyclone. Here goes the Breta Yump. Boop. Yeah, you even like yeah, get a bit more solo and low. This is correct. Like the, the faster you go into transition, the more solo you get. Look at the point one. It could have been even faster if I didn't get hit by the fluke. <laughs> This can be fun. This is like a little bit sloppy here, but workable. So, chat, um, le let me talk about my psychology. I'm usually getting attached. Like, there are multiple places where nerves kind of hit me during 112% run. Um, I think usually I'm getting a touch after the green fight. Like after the green fight is where I actually know that I, I have a run going, you know. So it often results in me getting like shaky fungal wastes and things regardless. Oh, that was a fuck up. I fucked up the... Oh my god. That was, that was really bad. I shouldn't have missed that second shriek. But double double? Pog? Yeah, that, that was alright, you know, it could have been better, I got like one bad pattern, and I did one mistake, I have done one mistake. But that, that was fine, you know, that was alright. Yeah, you can double on dashes. You can also on dash, you can also do three hits into Shade Soul, depending on whether you need soul or not. So there's like two different strats on dashes you can do. You can also time your Descending Dark to get like... Two ticks. Maybe even three, I don't know. Two HP is very comfortable uh, going into Fungal Core. And 107 runners are crying right now by hearing that. That, that was bad movement. That wasn't optimal at all. But I don't really care about this room that much. I think you can try to squeeze two cyclones here. I even experimented with this once, but I didn't really like it. Almost got hit there. Actually, accidentally pressed too early. Yeah, yeah, in Green King you go here over Charmed with the... You go here over Champion 107 and fight Big Grimkin, like Grimkin Nightmare, or how the fuck they call it. Yeah, 
Yeah, Darkness uh, King, that's how a lot of people done it because Mantis Lords are so close to the claw pickup, which is like early game. Here goes the overcharmed uh, TMG fight to Master Grim, which is very sketchy strat. It saves like 30 seconds compared to an overcharmed fight, but can cost you a run. <coughs> Excuse me. I kinda wanna get to bathroom. <laughs> Speaking of getting to bathroom, in this run I I wanted to pee like really really bad. Almost the entire run. <laughs> yeah, here I, I mess up the shriek. So you see what happened. I mess up the shriek and got hit twice. So so kind of unlucky plus mistake. So like you know <laughs> mistake plus ratio. So I, I got I got an extra heal. And got hit one more time, so that heal was kind of good. But it's fine. Like the third cycle is pretty much consistent. <laughs> he wasn't. Yeah, exactly. Like I, I wanted to be so bad, and in calls, in calls, I, I just couldn't think about anything else. I mean, it's the usual, you know. It's the usual. It's just one twelve situation. I lost uh, 10 seconds here because extra balloon, but at least I survived. That heal, that last heal I did was really coming in handy. Uh, my uh, Shroomek, my nail is K and my um, dash is uh, semicolon on uh, ANSI keyboard, on like an American QWERTY keyboard. Yeah, yeah, I have to wait a fucking hour. In loadless, in real time is like hour 20 <laughs> or something crazy. Yeah, I waited here to not get hit by fucking RNG because fuck that infected grass. I could have done wings here, but wings consistently gives me floaty jump, so I just do this. Look at this dodge chat. I'm actually like, I'm aware of the situation around me. <laughs> Urine makes me think, but yeah, I'm also I'm a minute ahead. Again, it's not my best pace. It's not my best 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 pace ever, but it's pretty solid so far. It's pretty solid. I haven't done any major fuck ups yet. That's what that's what is important. <laughs> Got hit here, unfortunately. So yeah, kind of botched the kill. So but whatever. It's like don't, don't care. Uh, current charms is Shaman Stone, Defender's Crest, and Dash Master. And the only reason I wear Defender's Crest here is for the Leg Eater discount. As you might know, you can get a discount from Leg Eater charms if you wear Defender's Crest. And that's the only reason I'm wearing it now. For money. <laughs> And yeah, this is where, uh, so as I said a bit before, this is where I start getting a bit nervous. It saves 240 GO, I think, slower, if I, if I recall correctly, so it's a lot. This is an unfortunate situation, the, sh the jelly went high, so I had to up slash it. That was a bit sketchy too, but I was confident in it, so I, I just went for it. I mean, damage, you, deal, you barely deal any damage with it. That was a bad dash. Oh yeah, and if you are on 142, 144. <laughs> yeah. Nice Cyclone. White Lady Nostalgia. That's a nice lore. Builder game. So yeah, uh, get the notch, I'm 50 seconds ahead and I'm kinda getting nervous here because I know that after a green fight, if you're still alive, you have a pace. You like really have a pace. So yeah, we are unequipping the Defender's Crest and whipping a uh, Spell Twister. And this is what we're gonna wear like forever, up until Kingdom's Edge. We would just equip Grim Child once and then equip it. But this is our charm loadout for the next like almost an hour. 
think it's just some soul collection strats for Elder Who. And look at this Elder Who ch fight chat. <laughs> Let's go. That, that, that was very good RNG. You can kill him in faster. You can heal him, kill him in three shrieks. That's all it takes. <laughs> but yeah, it was very blessed. Look at the time save though. <laughs> that was bad, like two random wall grabs. And I didn't grab the wall where I actually needed it. <laughs> I need Elder P. I was really needing Elder P. I actually kind of want to go to bathroom right now. I think I'm gonna do it. Actually, I'm gonna do it here. Just enjoy Umu fight. Nothing bad will happen. Just enjoy it. And look at the time save after Umu. That's gonna be insane. I'll be right back. Did you like the Umu fight? Okay, small time save incoming, nothing special. <laughs> Cheers everyone. If only I could go to bathroom like that in my actual... I was actually thinking chat, I was actually thinking. It's like 30 seconds of a cutscene enough for me to just rush to fucking bathroom and hold like a half of it or something. <laughs> yeah, Junker, the blinks. We have two different query modes. One is static and another one blinks. <laughs> Yo, Kuroshi. <laughs> Thanks for the sub, for the resub for two months. Appreciate it. But yeah, two minutes ahead, chat. Let's go. That's a pace. That's actually a pace. Still not the best pace ever, actually. My best pace ever was two fucking 30 here ahead. So I had a pace 30 seconds faster. Uh, did we close the guesses? No, there's just uh, one guess per person per stream, Gusten. <laughs> so I guess all the people that wanted to guess have guessed. Yes, Garnix, I've seen the tree skip. That was actually... That was ridiculous luck. It, it will never happen again. <laughs> I didn't... Like, you can see me not going for the most optimal strat post Umu for the mask shard, but you have to... You have to keep, give me some slack because I'm actually nervous here. Like, getting into... Um, Going into QG on such a pace is... I'm, in QG I usually get nervous when I'm ahead, not gonna lie. I mean, there is no downside in people guessing, you know, through it. So I'll just let people guess. <coughs> Hi, Isog. I'm not playing, I'm commentating. My hands are free. <laughs> this is a flying PB I got yesterday. I got hit here, that's unfortunate. I usually like um, cyclone, in, cyclone dropping into down dash 
to avoid hardfall. Unfortunately, I got hit. That's fine, though. HP here aren't super critical. <laughs> and I need a one hit here. Oops, nice hit. Just for the good measure. So yeah, 207 ahead, that's good. Not the best pace ever, but, you know... First trial of key acid skip, yeah, is my steer, let's go. I'll actually tell you when, I, when my pace will become the best ever. <laughs> wow, people starting to believe in 312. Like, at the start of the run, people were like, yeah, 314, like... 315, you know? Now people are voting 313, 312, I see, I see. <laughs> Believers rise up. Oh, I bonked into the mimic. <laughs> There's a plenty of places to fuck up the run. <laughs> but only the first 10 people who have guessed close enough will get the sub. <laughs> I can still like die and lose a minute easily, like like Hive can lose a lot of time. Colas can lose a lot of time, you know. They can die a flower. <laughs> you just wanted to get lead. <laughs> Hugaile, if you want to guess you can uh, redeem a channel reward. With your guest time for statistics. Yeah, Big B acts like the other day for sure. That was like 25 seconds. B, this is this is like the usual uh, yeah usual arena strat I'm going for. It has gives a very good soul, so you can hit these corpses. You see, very easy, like nice and easy, and like just just absolutely beautiful. This guy was really up there, so I decided to not go for Crystal Dash, just go to the straight to the left. Yeah, mindful. You have to be mindful about it, you know what? Whoops, the bonk. Bonk before frogs. Oh my god, chat. That's so bad. Losing HP here, you don't want to do that. Uh, yeah, Pox. Right, left trick is on all patches, that I know of at least. I haven't played the first couple patches, that, but 1-2-2-1 and 1 current patch both have these distinctions. Nice hit here. Y you see me, I'm not rushing it, I'm trying to be safe, so I didn't even crystal dash here, because fuck secretary frog. That was my bad, I shouldn't have up slashed into dash, so... The last hit is definitely on me, but still, I mean, I got two hit frogs, it's very good. Even though I lost some time because I went uh, safer. Yeah, yeah, the final frogs is called Secretary Frog, Slorent. And the Heartfall, unfortunate. And look at the door, just, oh my god, sexy. Yeah, because it's kind of, you know, keeps the door. It acts like a secretary before the second, before the next room. <laughs> That's nice. That was good, Marmo. Still losing time, but <clears throat> my PB had like ridiculous Marmo. Two ten ahead. Kind of gaining time on my PB, and yeah, I kind of fucked this up, so I decided just whatever, lose a couple more seconds. Yes, Lauren, that's the correct name. Hey, messes. I'm getting. I didn't need this soul totem. I don't know why. I, I was nervous. Ch ch I was really nervous. Like, you see, I have fuck ton of soul, fuck ton of HP, but nerves are nerves. Like, you can't just igno <laughs> ignore them. At least I'm not doing, like, you know, big mistakes, like getting screwed by the spikes or something. Those unoptimal soul collection and some kind of fucked up jumps is just to kind of chill me a bit. This is usually what I'm doing to cope with nerfs. I guess like I'm learning backup strats and easier strats and I'm just 
Instead of doing the most optimal thing, I'm just falling back on something more safe. Just to keep me sane, and I think it helps me a lot. For example, I never go for this underplot. It, it really... it's really not worth it. Look at the nail cancels. Oh my god, that's like so good. And screams. Yeah, I fucked up one uh, and he, he decided to troll me right away. Ah, you little fucker. This is a good uh, damage tank because it's only one HP. Look at him, look at him go. <laughs> yeah, he decided to troll me a little bit, that's fine. <laughs> but it doesn't really matter because my PB uh, uh, Queen's Gardens was really bad. Hey, five brain things. I forgot the last dash here. Yeah, I'm just kind of uh, shaking and I'm, I'm really happy that I went past this shit. <laughs> Still save time though. You see, I saved four seconds and nine more to go. That's very comfortable, Queen's Gardens. And we are two minutes and 15 seconds ahead. Is this a five head? The any percent all glitches world record holder? Are you still holding the world record five brain? It's it's like hard to tell because it's so many. Like it just kind of keeps changing right now. You you are. Let's go. <laughs> what is real Drain Wolf? Hey Vex, hello. Oh, I see. I mean, I thought Staxis is grinding it as well. Oh my god, that hurt! I have... I don't think if I ever done this mistake in 112 before. <laughs> oh, that bonk. Yeah. <laughs> but at least I got the boost on the second try, you know. Yeah, yeah, I, I meant, I meant any percent. Oh, Staxis has it, yeah, yeah, I see. Ah, you have trending, I see, I see. Babala. <laughs> the floor boost. <laughs> yeah, that hurt. And, and, like, the rest of it was kind of clean, so... Really unfortunate. <laughs> That's fine, I think it's like 5 seconds of a time loss or something. No, not the worst, you know, thing in, in life. I'm actually not gonna lie, so before doing this run, I practiced uh, Hornet 2, I have practiced Deep Nest, I have practiced... Uh, I think I have practiced Colos and something else. Yeah, I don't remember. I have practiced some, some parts before doing that run. And let's see if my deep nest practice pays off. Well, I kind of fucked up the beginning, but that was, you know, one in 1000 mistakes. I like never do this mistake ever. But still, over two minutes ahead. This is, this is a very good pace. Not the best pace ever though. I'm not on my best pace. I'm just on a, on a second best pace. This is definitely second best pace. Unlucky hit, kind of. Will I go for the cycle and drop that Jenker has lapped out? That saves point one. <laughs> what was this run's final time? You never believe what happens. Stick around. Five brain. Have you seen my uh, thumb YouTube thumbnail idea? Uh, not yet, Vex. I think I'm gonna lab it out a bit. But we'll see how I feel about it. Look at
at the strats though. That devout kill was fucking optimal. And look at this down dash. Oh! This down dash is so goated. You only needed to reset your heart fall. So you just land on the ledge into instant crystal dash and don't have to like do a cringe dash. I stole it from Monster. Oop, got bonked here. <laughs> I like how I do some cool strat and then do like a little mistake that kind of neglects the time loss overall. <laughs> cringe dash sounds like an actual strat, yeah. Wow, Rick, so toxic. <laughs> A bit of a time loss, that's fine. It's like for getting hit by the husk. I also labbed out a new strat for the Zolt room, like Zolt Gauntlet, Spider Gauntlet. <laughs> yeah, and I, I gotcha. <clears throat> Look at the Geo. I don't need this Geo. Fuck this Geo. Because I get Defender's Crest the discount, I don't have to do two dashes here, back and forth. Pre-jump lever into Crystal Dash, let's go. You see, when Spirit is not watching, I'm not fucking up the strat. <laughs> uh, I just I just like read a uh, name of my lightest follower and it got me smiled. I won't call them out, but it was very fun. But it is very fun to which name. <laughs> look at the strat chat. Oh, look at the moves. Three at the same D Dark. Then two. And Shriek. Look at the strats. Look at the moves, though. Yeah. The last one, just in case he's down. And 0.5 gold. I worked so hard on this strat. And it's fun that every runner has like their own take on this room. Because this room is so bad. Like this gauntlet actually sucks. I intentionally slow down my cycle here. By the way. Hey Hazel, hello. Thank you. <laughs> Hey, no, Ned, thank you as well. I I'm actually not writing this, see, it's pre-recorded. I got this PB offline, now I'm kind of just watching it. And look, you know, so, so far my deepness practice is kind of paying off, right? So far it's really good. Still not the best pace ever, though. Let's see how Nosk will go. Notice that I'm running against my Nosk gold. Running with my feet. Not the best movement so far, but lovely down dash. There is nothing that lovely down dash can't fix. I'm not even playing here, yeah. see? My hands are free. It's pre-recorded. <laughs> yeah, dance pad. You see Gustin how it's done. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> That's a nice mode. And we pout. <laughs> like this Noska RNG is not even the best. But look how I'm playing it. I'm actually fucking destroyed the guy. Yeah, I'm recording through OBS when I'm flying. AP Rabbit. And also when I'm offline as well. Look at this fucking gold. Look at this fucking gold. Seven seconds. He didn't even jump into the ceiling. I just destroyed his motherfucking ass. I just terminated this guy. <laughs> oh, 
Also, look at this uh, sharp shadow cycle. Intentional damage tank. You don't need to dash here, you can just yeah, do this. And second intentional damage tank, so you iframe through the next one. Just beautiful. There's a multiple ways to get the same cycle, it's just the one I'm going for. Oh, missed the jump. The cycle is kind of... <laughs> it's not going to be a world record, I can tell you that. Do you think if I would have gotten world record, I would have set new PB showcase? I would have sell out, I would sell out the fuck out of it. This is not my best pace ever, by the way. Still, it's it's not my best pace that I that I've ever got. It's close though, and I yeah I missed I missed the pogo here. <laughs> so yeah, losing three seconds. Like missing that pogo loses three seconds. Two point three because my movement was decent. Still not the best pace ever, by the way. My best pace ever was 2 minutes and like 32 seconds. So this is 7 seconds slower than my best pace ever. Something along these lines. So you can say that it's pretty much my best pace ever. Look at this knockback cancel. Let's go. And the, the rest of the room is just so clean. Thanks Garnix and uh, thanks for the congrats. Uh, my, my best pace ever has died in uh, Colo 2. So stastic. I did like a very stupid mistake. Or wait, not in Colo 2. That's a good question. I think it was in Colo 2. It was either Colo 2 or fucking Watcher Knights, something like that. No, 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 I brought it all the way to God home. I died to Hornet 2 in P5. Yes, I lost a minute in late game, two mistakes, and then I died in P5. Yeah, yeah, that's what happened. So that pace just kind of faded away. Look at the moves here. Not, well, not, not those moves, the beginning of the room. I don't know, I always kind of get uh, two souls here. Yeah, the, the death you joked about. Yeah, I golded Nos by 7 fucking seconds. Yeah, it wasn't that decent of a gold, actually. Here I had like a very good movement and my Nosk fight was just mistakeless. It was like the perfect for the RNG pattern I've gotten spirited. He didn't even go to ceiling. Like, he was grounded all the way. I just, I just did optimal DPS. <laughs> so yeah, like my best pace ever kind of faded away in Hive. I lost 35 seconds in Hive, and also lost the gold. Look at the beginning of this. Oh my fuck! <laughs> Just let me in, man. That, that that's not very clean beginning. <laughs> not gonna lie. See, so I like. Okay. I was okay. Okay, chill, chill the fuck out. I I kind of redeemed my deep nest. Like, my practice really paid off, saved a lot of time in Deep Nest. Just get this uh, B out of the way, you know, I have a lot of soul, just 1 HP less. So, nothing, nothing bad will happen, you know. You see, I'm not going for the most optimal strats here. So, here I just kind of bailed out and went down, even though you can optimally pogo this guy into wings, dash wings. Don't like don't buffer wings here. <laughs> Vex is coping hard. <laughs> and look at the big B. Will I get good one or will I get bad one? Oh, up slash optimal. Big B is super like far to the right. Like this is a bad big B already. And here I'm just kind of waiting, you know. I'm killing all these bees. I don't want to deal with them. I guess I killed like the Hask because, see like Big B was just so slow, like what the fuck is he doing? Come on, let's go. So yeah, that, that wasn't a good Big B, it was kind of bad. But I mean 11 seconds is is fine, as long as it's not 20, as long as it's not 20 chat, I, I'm fine, copium. <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> Thanks, water. Appreciate it. Plus high. Let's see how the fight will go. Mercy fights uh, are aren't that good. Nice couple shrieks. Yeah, I failed to turn around here. I need I have to turn around, but I yeah, yeah, that, that's like unoptimal shrieks. I'm kind of miss, barely missing inputs. So two mistakes on fight so far. That doesn't really count, that's a teleport. And finally, good turnaround. <laughs> yeah, that was nice. So, so you see, I did two mistakes, but I did the spiral out of control. That's good, that's very good. Also, let me add Queen's Gardens, uh, QG. I'll practice Queen's Gardens too. To my, to my list. Also Hive, yeah. I fucked up a couple things in Hive. Yeah, hey Blue. By the way, now this is an official best pace ever. So, this is an official best pace ever. <laughs> now we can hype all out. Look at the RNG climb too. This climb is the worst climb in the game because it's so random. Every uh, every fucking enemy here is just an RNG fest, so you just kind of have a general idea how to go about it, and you play play around. What the fuck, Slimatil? Blue PB today, actually. So yeah, joke on you. Get fucked. <laughs> <laughs> Toxic streamer. Yo, let's go. Spirity said nice things about my movement. <laughs> I'm so happy. And I instantly fuck up the dash here. <laughs> Wow, happy smile thinks I'm gonna like get world record by 40 seconds. <laughs> I've told this is not gonna world record. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for believing to me in advance. Yeah, I got hit by this hopper because they kind of backed out. Shouldn't have done it. <laughs> Look at this primal aspects. Just sniping me back and forth, man. That's fine though. It's okay, Marcus gets fucked. He gets fucked sideways. <laughs> Thanks, Ellie Bright. Yeah, and how good night was Anki? Gold with Markov. <laughs> hey, Sleepy Creep. Yeah, that's the best pace ever, like, hands down. Also, I'm. Um, um, <laughs> Yeah, Blue, you need to fix your mentality, for sure. Okay. Uh. <clears throat> but I like the progress. This split, I wasn't... Uh... It's not unbeatable, come on, Blue. Like, it's, it's very beatable. Don't lie to yourself. Like, if Axe, like, to you would run 112, he would have gotten sub-1720 consistently. <laughs> oh, I accidentally pressed Wings uh, a jump instead of Dash here. But actually, in Kingdom Search, I wasn't nervous at all. 
because uh, I'm bond here. That's fine though. I practiced uh, Kingdom Sedge recently, so I was very confident here. I guess it's like mentality when you don't want to throw something in your run to get a time safe later, you know? <laughs> so like, yeah, full on believe in yourself. Don't be afraid of the time safe and all that. Here I kinda got distracted, that's why Crystal Dash all... That was just bad, like... You always get hit by this uh, hopper if you hit him like that. Yeah, yeah, it's exercise ball. I mean, come on, Spirit, you can't focus on your gameplay all the time if you do an online runs. When you stream, it's just impossible. Interacting with the chat is part of the fun, and you, uh... And you will get distracted, it's just inevitable. Like, it's impossible in the stream condition, unless you fully, like, go, like, you know, muted ignoring part. Also, I... I absolutely, like, shoved my dick into his ass. Like, he, he just got, got, like, absolutely fucked. Look at this collector. Like, he died. I'm losing time, but because I got hit by the hopper. <laughs> Look at this collector, dude. He had, like, no chance. <laughs> I'm sorry, like, horny lurkers that I made you on lurk. <laughs> Look at the pace, 2.30 ahead, let's go. I, I, yeah, I got bonked here. <laughs> Wish I was collector right now. Wow. Okay, this is a mature audience only, so I let it slide. <laughs> You are allowed to be a bit edgy here. It's fine. I don't dream nail that guy. I dream nail this guy so he gets out of the way before I can see dash here. I think it's better. Actually, I'm not waiting for any comments, Rix. I'm not entitled to your puns. You know? So far, this is a pretty nice split, by the way. <clears throat> like, I don't do mistakes and all that. Here, I done a mistake. I missed the first. Uh, I missed the first tick of damage on the D Dark, and since my Shriek did only three ticks, he didn't die. So I had to uh, burn a Shade Soul. So that, that's that's like a small mistake. Also, 1.5 elevators. Very good. Do three jumps instead of four here. This is what any percent runners is doing. So it must be optimal. Maybe like three into short wings is faster here, but I don't know. Oh, that was unfortunate. He, he like sometimes when they roll, they their recall is a bit too big, and you get hit like that. Here just didn't have enough soul. But it's fine, I know that he's like dead. Same thing, like... I'm missing like some... I'm losing some times because, you know... They... I don't have soul. But... They, they're dead. I didn't die, so... It's all good. Hitless fight. I'm improving my Watcher Knights. I actually practiced uh, City recently, after the death. Yeah, yeah, I could have had an, I could have, and I should have gotten uh, another dream nail, five brain. That that was like the main, the, the main mistake I've done. For real. Can I get in cold? The window is blowing uh, on my ass. I need to wear something. That was like a decent luring. 
Good movement into like okay fight with only a couple seconds lost. And since my gold is not that optimal here, uh, I'm gonna gold it, I think. I am in uh, western part of Russia, Sleepy Creek. Yes, and we didn't die to Watchers. Very big moment for the stream, by the way. And I'm still on my best pace ever. 240, by the way. Look at him go! Oh, by the way, I will add something else to practice. <coughs> At least. Greetings from Maine. Hello, hello. <laughs> I like uh, Maine because Stephen King <laughs> writes a, a lot of stories uh, that all reside in the small city of the state Maine. <laughs> <laughs> I got hit there, it's bad for soul. Yeah, HK, Hollow Knight. Indeed. And this space is indeed getting hot. Hollow Knight, Boris Hollow Knight. Bellamy Ardred. Boris Helmadelka. Jenka, that was a bit too, like, a uh, niche of a joke for someone new <laughs> to the stream. <laughs> I'm sorry for that sleepy creep. <laughs> I personally apologize. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> uh, hey, crispy bacons. It was a good joke, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it was a good one. Then does you. Yeah, the pace is kind of getting hot though, and this is like, I think another point when I kind of get nervous is going to call us. Yeah, Pimpas, we have a pace. World record pace, question mark? Is there any big time? I mean, there are the time save all of I have 15 seconds of a time save in Call 3. Well, against Kamsop, but still, you know. I decided to go full soul here, because I just wanted wanted it. Oh, I mean, my pantheons have a lot of time safe always, yeah. PB pantheons suck. <laughs> hey, Under, hello, welcome. I had like yeah, 22.56. Yeah, that C-dash is worth the Jenker. My P5 had 22.56 and, you know... Other Pantheons were kind of alright, but like I, I mean it over time save there. White Defender wasn't the greatest, I think. It wasn't the worst though, like a good DPS here. Only one hit so far. Yeah, it went for the double here. That was a good a good strat. That, that was like, I knew he would scream like here or there, so I just... And, and that was bad because, you know, I don't have any soul. I should have went for the <coughs> Dream Nails here. And I've only kind of realized this post-fight. You can get a nice uh, Dream Wilder Dream Gate here for soul, but it's whatever. He's like died. He's like dead. My White Defender is generally not very good. It's like my gold is 5 seconds slower than Kam, so, so no wonder I haven't lost any time to my gold here. Like, this fight wasn't trash, it just had a couple misplays here and there. Oh yeah, yeah, my PB Pantheons are much better than the last PB Pantheons, that's for sure. So I don't have, like, just free to grab time save, they're still out of time save, though. So my 315 Pantheons is 2 minutes and 30 seconds slower than Monsters. Just as a comparison. Like, I mean, overall got home. And even, even, even then, uh, my Pantheons are okay in IELTS, but I struggle a lot to get good Pantheons at the end of the run, because at the end of the run I'm usually so fucking tired. 
I just can't play them consistently. And they require hyper focus and a like top notch fucking execution, you know? I'm sitting on a ball, Golden Mist. I'm not on my chair. <laughs> Oh yeah, you can just dream gate out immediately. Elbright. The climb was okay. N not gold. I got hit. And uh, I kind of fucked up the movement post white def post white defender. So it's not a gold, but it's still alright. The climb itself was good. That's that's for sure. Yeah, run was on the ball as well, Colette. I've like spent an entire four hours on the ball. And my back is like really sore now, my back muscles. <laughs> I don't know, I just feel it feel like it's purity. I just kinda of feel like sitting on the ball. Polo time. Yeah, I have to burn one extra shade so because they don't die. They didn't die. Hey Sawayoshi, yeah, I'm bouncing on the ball. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just can't not bounce. When you're sitting on the ball, you have to bounce. Oh, and yeah, and like, couldn't get a, an aspid. Oh yeah, Jenker. Yeah, but if you jump too early uh, in an easy pop-up, you will invalidate your run. Some coke and pizza. This is prime type of battle. Look at this shade cell, holy shit. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> you shouldn't really go for Dream Nail here. I just realized you can kill the guys from the right and get some soul. Yeah, I, I really like rewatching this run and chilling instead of like being all, you know, nervous. <clears throat> this is a decent color one so far. I did like one mistake when I missed an aspid. Also, yeah, I missed the second one, so... Come on, just die, yeah. The day name was bad, but they kind of separated right away and it's very hard to... Uh, yeah. It's very hard to get them optimally, I guess. Bad RNG as well, you see, like, y you need this uh, pickup to be as far to the left as you can. <laughs> so yeah, small time save, I think. Yeah, 0.3 or time save, that's a nice start. <laughs> uh, no, so he's, he's, he, he's bounce really weird and he will bounce like 3 meters. And yeah, blue world record is not uh, so much of a like mechanical thing. It's more of nerves. It, it's more about nerves, really. <coughs> I think Monster had it easier because for him it was just you know PV. Like he, he was on the first place for so 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 many times. Like for him it's just another PB in the pocket. But if you're kind of climbing from the bottoms, you have to overcome. Also look at these strats. I love them so much. Uh, practice uh, helps a lot with nerves, but 
the only thing that will... Uh, but the thing that help you the most with nerves is getting paces. <laughs> Micro documentaries. The 112 uh, world record speedrun history. It was like Zeno, Zef, Zeno, Zef, monster, 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 then monster retired, then Zef, then it, again monster, 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 blue, monster, 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 monster. <laughs> <laughs> Here, I just done it for you. <coughs> oh, no, really By the way, this Call of Duty is going good. I'm not commenting it much, but there's not that much to watch anyway. It's just going fine, you know. It's just whatever. No, no big mistake so far. No, it's not faster than upslash bell flies because you need to kill bell flies as soon as they spawn. And up slashes take some time to um, to set up. So if you see butterfly appearing at all, you already lose time. That's why you need to see that uh, great slash in advance. So the butterfly kind of spawns into the great slash hitbox or into the shriek uh, hitbox. <coughs> so yeah, up slashes lose time technically. Also, I like my previous space before that died in Call of Two, so you can see me. I'm kind of nervous here. Not gonna lie. Um, <coughs> so I will go super slow here, slow and steady. You see, I'm I'm like I'm staying the fuck away from these guys. I'm not even like timing my kills. I'm really like trying to kill them one by one, without like going close. You see what I'm doing? I'm waiting for the attack. I'm losing time intentionally. Just to make sure I'm, I'm not getting the same mistake again. It's very easy to mess up here. You see what I'm doing? I'm jumping. I'm, I'm like very careful here. I lost like 7 seconds, 10 seconds here. I could have killed them so much faster, but fuck that. This is bad. This is really bad because only one of them died. So now I kind of have to beach a little bit. But it's fine. I, I played it very well. Hey, insert things. This is pre-recorded PD, by the way, so I'm just kind of commentating over it. So you see, it, it's my mentality. I missed, I missed a pace here recently, so now I play on a safer side. Because I played on a safer side, I lose some time. I, I, and this is actually one of one of the strats I employ to fight the nerves. You see, I mean, blue. It doesn't fucking matter. What your PB gets in the first 30 minutes, like first 20 minutes. Missed yesterday? I mean, I'm not doing runs every day. Happy smile. I'm not. Ah, you mean that it's like uh, an even? That's like zero, 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 zero. I see. It. Like full number. Yeah, yeah. I thought you meant that, it's been, that it, will be, it will be hard to run against. Yeah, that's actually really cool. Look at the beginning of Call of 3, it's actually like so good. Look at the snail cans, and they all died. So fast. Yeah, new second place, exactly in third space. <clears throat> like this this start was so good of Call of 3. But I don't go I don't gonna I'm not gonna lie, I'm really nervous here. Colos is usually like third time when I feel the nerves on 112 pace. Yeah, BB before was also the second place, but it's like, I mean, it was, you know, like my previous PB was the second uh, place of Schrodinger. Because whether it was second place or not, it really depended on Blue. <laughs> because Blue's been getting like sick paces every fucking day. <laughs> You see how, how, how safe I'm playing? Like, I'm really scared here. I'm really, really scared here. So yeah, I was gonna, I, I was gonna tell, right? Um, so I, I was gonna tell that... Uh, one of the strats I'm using to cope with nerves is 
I'm falling back on, on slower strats intentionally. And since I'm kinda... I, I know slow strats as well as I know fast strats, I'm not fucking them up. So it's kind of a strategy <coughs> I use to get over nerves. When my hands become shaky, I just, you know, put less stress on them. <clears throat> but it's a decent, like, it's it's slow, Hollow 3 for sure. It's not the fastest one because, you know, frogs were kind of slow. That was so sketchy over dash slash, I almost got hit there. That was good. So it's 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 kind of slow. Like frogs were slow, I guess. Uh, Call of three, but so far no major mistakes, which is very good. You see what happened? That guy survived <laughs> on the right. He he like I framed. Yeah yeah he I framed one of the ticks, Riggs, and he survived. <laughs> My real summer best is like 304, but I have so, so I, I don't have much splits. And my splits like fucking two or three minutes. So yeah, it's hard to compare. But yeah, it's a good call of three so far. Look at this great slash. Oh my god, in between so good. Almost got hit into the spikes. Nice, v very good cleanup here and how had a lot of soul. That was unfortunate damage uh, damage trade. I, I should have avoided that. I stole that uh, great slash from Monster. That was unfortunate hit. You see what I'm trying to I'm trying to play I'm playing really safe here. Like, really, really safe. Nice timing. So it was it was really slow. It was very slow frogs. But very safe ones. And yeah. You see what I'm doing? I'm avoiding enemies, like... Because I'm really nervous. I'm like... I feel the nerves. That was very bad, because he didn't die from D-Dark. I did not expect that. I missed like an entire tick of damage. You, you can see me like, you can see me be nervous. You see, you see, this is like pure nerves. But it's alright. Like, I kinda got my shit together and didn't throw. Uh, no, probably. They are quite, quite, quite different. <coughs> 107 is really nice hybrid between 112 and 106. It's kind of its own thing now. <coughs> <laughs> nice got got hit. Okay, like no shriek, no nothing, just like die. <laughs> so yeah, it was it was very slow call of three. Actually mostly mostly because frogs and the like soul uh, like spell walter or twist walter, I don't know how they call this red dudes. The one that I pitched a lot. But yeah, I, I think I just barely, yeah, saved one second. Uh, in Colos, I mean two golds? Like 20, like 25 seconds to golds, I think. Gold twisters, thanks, Pimpus. The, the third wall jump here wasn't necessary. Some nice movement that I lapped out. Almost like floorless. Yeah, it's all right. I definitely could have played it more aggressive, but I decided to pitch. I'm always doing lower route, Jenker. I have never in my 112 career has done have done a top route. Never ever. Even a year ago, I was doing the bottom route. <laughs> hmm. 
Uh, yeah, have a good night, mindful. I understandable. I, I started really late. I was watching blue. <laughs> I totally didn't do it to snipe the raid. Wink, wink. <laughs> Baba Gondala. <laughs> Hey Quad, what's up? I see Americans tuning in. When I see that people from North America are tuning in, I know that I'm fucking the gem. <laughs> nice gold. And yeah, blue, I mean... <laughs> Look at this gold. Look at this gold! I'll add colors to the practice mix. Colors. <laughs> Post commentating offline PB. I'm not the one who invented the strat quack. I've stolen it from Bob's uh, Celeste streamer and from uh, D Baby. <laughs> <coughs> yes, uh, Bob's had uh, got his 26 in Celeste uh, on his alt account and then kind of premiered it. Um, on his main channel, like back in the days, <laughs> when he like world recorded by point three or something. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, that was an amazing stream water. And Bob stole it himself. Nice, yeah. So it's like triple stole. <laughs> you see, much in my that, that movement was kind of bad on Shape of One, but at least, at least. <laughs> nice one, Kled. It was probably a long time ago. <clears throat> yeah, only like one room in green path blue. Like the vessel fragment room. <clears throat> I mean, the first room is optimally, you optimally do, do not touch in the acid anyway. Just learn good strats, like in hunter grub. Like, you, you, you shouldn't touch uh, acid here anyway. Like, there's absolutely no reason to. Wow, Pox. No, uh, no trust in my like lead game at all. Wow, Spirit, you was initiated. Look at this! Inv I didn't get an inventory drop. Damn. Double commentary. I see, Khaled. That actually sounds like a content. Of course, double dream nail. I always get it. I have a sound cue for it. Missed like half of the shriek. Look, like this great result is so bad, but you have to, you have to like chat. You have to understand first. I'm dying. Like my bladder is so full at this point. I wanted to get to the bathroom in fucking green path, an hour into the run, and now I can't think of anything else. So you gotta cut me some slack. It surely affected my colos and everything after that. I just wanna, I just wanna go to the bathroom and nothing else. Look at what I'm doing, like this is so bad. This this fight was bad, but... Uh... <clears throat> yes, Spirit, that's a very good strat. You see I'm farming viewers as well. <laughs> Man, they're back, let's go! So the secret why I always do great slash to the right, I don't want to kill Menderbag. <laughs> I would never kill Menderbag. He's like th the best bug in Hollow Nest. <clears throat> oh, see, I'm like on a bathroom break. Right now. <laughs> I do PBs. I always have to go to bathroom, but sometimes, uh, you know, more. You know, actually, what? I'm gonna do a bathroom break right now. And you watch this useless split and shopping that I'm gonna gold, by the way. This shopping is gonna be gold spoilers. Because I'm so good at the game.
<laughs> I'll tell you, uh, Chisinator. Um, if I, if 112 didn't have uh, two minutes of a bathroom break, I wouldn't have run this category. I like, <clears throat> I can absolutely tell you that. <laughs> Is this your hair? This is no, this is not hair. This is like a who do you think? <laughs> my hair is like Here's my hair. Is your hair braided? Braided? What is braided? What does braided means? Um I'm 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 Google translating this shit braided. Braided. Oh no, they're not. They're just loose. <laughs> they're, they're just loose. I'm, I'm I don't have any braids. Look at the gold. What the fuck is the data? I, I wanna get such a good bladder. I, I can't hold it for four hours. <laughs> uh, I get a lot of golds, but I mean, my sum of best isn't very optimized. You know, I kinda came back to the category like two months ago or something. So. <laughs> if you did, you could get a sponsor. Braid Shadow Legends. Wow, Jenker. I know, that's a questionable one. <laughs> nice inventory drop into hard fall. Oh, you so see, you couldn't get a bathroom break because of it was a race. Yeah, I see. Usually when I play, play around in Hollow Knight, it's very chill and casual, so I can take a break whenever I want. Uh, this is a fake gold. I accidentally fucked up the route the other day, so stastic, so it was a fake gold. I already cleaned it up in my splits. Also, here is... I'm really nervous here, like... So, there's a couple things to this flower quest. There's nothing to reframe, really happy smile. This is gonna be PB, so I don't know. <laughs> Jager, are you referring to like Colette's <coughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Colette's 48 hours like room enemy rando? <laughs> so I've opened up uh, Colette's stream today, like in my morning, and of course it was seven hours into Colette's stream, and you know what I see? I see a fucking Google Doc with a mind map so big that it lacks the entire stream. <laughs> A mind map that connects like rooms in enemy Randall. 
<laughs> okay, so again, back to the run. Uh, I'm super nervous on this flower quest. <laughs> and again, when I'm nervous on flower quest, I do what? I slow down. There's absolutely no reason to rush on flower quest. You don't need five seconds in exchange to a minute and a half. See, I, I miss up the C dash and I'm just walking back. No thanks, get me back to the room and charge the crystal dash. This is what you do in this room, by the way. <coughs> yeah, nice cycle. I mean, Blue didn't, like, uh, do anything sketch today, he's just, like, done a genuine mistake, it, it's okay. I mean, you're gonna do mistakes sometimes. See, I'm... so now I'm... so I'm tired already, it's... it's been, like, 3 a.m. or something. So, I'm just, you know, I'm just kind of get, taking it slow. So you see, instead of down dash, I just dashed straight because I didn't walk off the platform. And you see the movement here. I just waited. I waited for the cycle. You don't need to wait here. And I hard fell. This is pure nerves. This is just nerves. And I even waited for the fucking Numa fly. You don't have to wait. You can just dash. And I waited here. You don't have to wait here. <clears throat> so I just, I'm just losing time here on purpose because I'm nervous. I don't want to misclick anything here because one fucking misclick and you're screwed. Nice ceiling boost. <clears throat> yeah, I'm actually very nervous, so I just distress it a little bit. In QGM, I'm usually quite relaxed because QG is insanely consistent. <clears throat> Yeah, Serpent Strats and Flower Quest, no thanks. You see this jump? You don't need to do jump here, by the way. Oh, just walk off, don't do a dash. <laughs> yeah, so th this is a slow one. I think I'm gonna lose like five seconds or something, or maybe even six or seven, but it's fine. I'm, I'm on the best pace ever, and I'm almost three minutes ahead, so... There's no reason to be, like, you know, <clears throat> there's no reason to kind of stress about it. <laughs> Thanks, Jiznata. By the way, this is a pre-recorded PB, just in case. Like, I'm not playing right now, I'm just kind of watching my own run back. Hey, Marine. Thanks. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah, 8 seconds lost. Absolutely fine with that. It's okay. Now the White Palace, look at that. I missed the bell, yeah. Very nice start. And I actually haven't practiced White Palace in a while. Not gonna lie. I meant, I, let's, let me add this to the practice sheet. White Palace. White Palace onwards, actually. Yeah, White Palace, you like, you won't die in White Palace on, on 112. You can lose 20 seconds, like worst case. Maybe 40 seconds if, if your brain just, you know, leaves your body because of nerves. Like, if you're just, you're shaking so much, you just can't, you just can't hold it. You will lose like 40 seconds. But you will never die here. You just have too, mu too much HP, there's like bench all over, benches all over the place. So, at this point, your run is not really in danger of dying. Unless you fuck up the blue hearts. But I'll talk about it later. Cheers, poker. Yeah, kind of fuck up, fucked up this uh, cyclone drop. No, poker clouds are slower uh, in any category but trending because you have uh, big DPS, so you uh, uh, so you just kill kingdom mode fast enough. 
<laughs> Don't worry about it, Violet. It's gonna be alright. <laughs> so, White Palace has multiple Dash Master exclusive cycles that save time, but I'm not going for any of them. Like, I'm not going for the perfect Dash Master left out room that, uh, that, like, a Blue Dash or an Elixir, because, I mean, screw it. I'm doing, you see, this is like a regular cycle, non Dash Master one. It's just. So here I'm like, I get this, I got this, man. And. <laughs> I missed the platform, and no, I don't get this, I'll just wait, you see? Chat, you don't need to refresh your room, you just need to learn backup cycle. All you need to learn is backup cycles. <sighs> Knowing backups, here, just wait. I don't need to wait here, I know it, but I wait in case. I also drop the cycle, because. At this point, I'm not feeling confident. Like, I mess up the simplest thing, and inside my mind, I was like, okay. It, it's alright, just, 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 you know, take it easy. Don't go for anything sketchy, it's, you know, it's fine. So I just decided that this weight pass is gonna be laid back. So, already mentally, I dropped kind of all the strats that uh, I know how to do fast. And since I know how to do slower strats, I'm not just trying to win shit because I'm scared. Like Peach and no know what to, what to do. I actually know slow strats, I know how to do them properly, you know? That's why I, I, I didn't refresh the room to go for snake jumps again. You notice that on the left uh, at room. I waited for the soul cycle, I know... Here I... yeah. Like whatever, I messed like... I messed the jump up so I went for the easy strat here as well. So in left atrium, I didn't refresh my room to go for the snake jumps again. I just waited for the easy cycle. And it's fine, you have to learn it. Because refreshing rooms is slow. And you can mess up uh, snake jumps again, you know? When you're in such state of mind. Just learn the fucking backups. Like, knowing how to do backups is half of the long category <coughs> situation. And actually, I have an inspiration in the sense. Chad, do you know Cheese, uh, SM64 speedrunner? Like, if you know anything about speedrunning, you probably know Cheese, right? He's like a top runner, SM64, like, whatever. <laughs> Cheesy Nighter, be, be like, yeah, I know Cheese. <laughs> That's funny. So, yeah. <laughs> he's a backside, he's a backup, backup strats god, you know? Like, this guy knows so many backups. He's like, he never ceases to amaze me. When he fucks something up in 120 star run, he just knows how to back everything up. Like, for, for every fuck up, he knows how to back things up, you know? And he, he, he kind of told this on one of his streams that in the long runs, backup strats are half of the victory, so you just, you just learn them. And you see, I'm, I'm going for the slow strats in White Palace. I mean, in any percent you can't do backup strat, Jenker. Any percent short category, you just have to grid it and uh, take the reset. It's just part of the grind. Like, that's why in short categories uh, you just reset and go for optimal shit until you get it. That's why uh, short categories are such a grind. And long categories you need to get more runs going. It's just things that balances it out. Like, you could, you could say that if any percent such a short category, why world records don't get uh, beaten often there? I mean, because it's optimized, because it's hard to get uh, good times, because uh, mistakes are just more punishable. Yeah. Oh yeah, Elbright, the intended path here. I mean, shortcut is intended as well, but, <coughs> excuse me, uh, shortcutless strat is so hard. It's like immensely hard. <laughs> this one is much better. But yeah, you see, I lost seven seconds in, in White Palace and it's whatever. Yeah, it's very bearable loss. Exactly. I'm, I'm, you have to understand, I'm nervous, I'm tired. And I just make, made this decision in my mind that I will drop fast strats here. Hey, JX. Hello, hello. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> you see, like, people, like, I, I see Mathulu, like, I see Quack, I see JX, and I, I kind of know that this is, like, late. It's 3 a.m. And I'm fucking degen. <laughs> but yeah, I'm still happy to see you all, all of you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but yeah. Mm. 
<laughs> so uh, as I said, you know, if you if you run low categories, learn fucking backup strats, learn easier strats, learn slow cycles. <laughs> Speaking of blue hearts, you can afford one damage tank here, but not more. If you get hit more, you will lose like 40 seconds, easy, like 30 seconds. That's why I'm super slow here. And I have added White Palace onwards for a reason. You see what I'm doing? I dashed too late here. I just barely dashed too late here. I have equipped Fragile Heart Blue. I have equipped Fragile Heart. I'm losing like 7 seconds here because of that bonk. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, Dash Master. I don't. Uh, Dash Master isn't worth it. Isn't worth here. You're not using it anyway. No, it's faster to open up the shortcut. It's like four seconds faster. And here, you see, there is like an optimal cyclone where you get right into the ball. I avoided it. Optimal, you cyclone all the way here and then hang and then cling onto the wall into dash, or even just pop with the spikes. I didn't do that. I know how to do it. I just didn't because I was nervous. And I've added uh, White Palace onwards to my practice list, just so I, I am more consistent in it. And you see, you do optimal dream gates. Like you crystal dash all, all the way to to Lem. <laughs> like you do dream nail here, then you dream gate out, then you put another dream gate blue, and then you dream gate out again after nail smith. You barely even dash. You dash like four times. <laughs> this is like all skills climb. I'm not going for the climb that all, like 106 runners do. I just never bother learning it. All skills climb is good enough. Shout out to my all skills homies. I didn't go for turn around here though. I just did the, an easier one. Uh, that egg is for money. I need money for pure nail cheese nighter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is like the fastest one. Yeah, I'm adding. Yeah, I'm not dropping 112 spirit. I'm gonna keep uh, going. I I'm not done yet with the category. I don't feel like running anything else at the moment. What's my goal time in 112? You know, Quack. My like ambitious time. Well. Uh, <laughs> shall I ask all my all skills homies? Yes, indeed. Match the gold, nice. <laughs> my gold here is not very good. So, I don't really have a goal time, you know, like goal goal time. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna run until I'm happy with PB. Like, it, it would have been very cool to snipe sub 310 before monster gets it. Uh, but it's very ambitious and I'm not there yet. I'm, I'm gonna admit I'm not at sub 310 skill set skill level yet But I'm gonna keep going. I'm not done with the category yet. I, 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 I can tell that for sure. So 112, 112 goes on <coughs> I thought maybe throwing some all skills current patch into the mix But if I do it, I'm not gonna run all skills until Kuro gets 54 uh, and if I do it, I'll, I'm gonna Bell do it me, probably Bell offline. Yeah, baby Bell shades always very cute. <laughs> uh, blue, we'll see how Pantheons will go. I mean, this pace is alright. I know for a fact I can get a minute faster. Like, this pace is good for sure. Like, no shit. It's my best pace ever. But... Uh, I know my overworld can be at least a minute faster. Ah, Ronjo Stenja. <laughs> also, I forget to match. You see, so I watched the fucking cutscene. <laughs> Lost point eight, nice. But chat, I'm so tired. Like, I'm really tired at this point. This is another thing, like my Pantheon ILs are pretty good. I have finished four different 21XXP5 in ILs. And like tens of 22OX. 
but at the end of 112% run, it's such a different story. You are fucking tired, you are like nervous, and you need to hyper focus, you need, to, you, need hyper fo you need a hyper focus of an any percent run, for sure. Wow, blue. <laughs> Uh, Spirit, yes, this is way ahead of world record. Actually, I think I'm gonna spoil it right now, and this beats the world records over world by over a minute. Yes. <laughs> hey, Watson. No, uh, rough draw. Uh, this is not second PB. I got on while needing a P. Um, I, I really need a P on every fucking 112 run, but th this one was just really bad. World record is 228.52, I think, 50 something. It's 28.50 something. Like a uh, God Seeker Dream Nail. But I mean, you have to, you have to realize that we have like um, over a minute uh, worth of... Um, 232 is very nice, Blue, it's a very good one. Look at this, look at this route. I got lost here. I got fucking lost. I, I went into the wrong hole. <laughs> I got lost. Yeah, like I went into the wrong hole and... <laughs> lost like 10 seconds here because of that. <laughs> so yeah, that happened. Free 10 seconds, I guess. <laughs> That's why White Palace onwards is on my practice list. <laughs> but yeah, it's... Um, um, yeah, this beats world records over world by a minute. But you also have to realize that we have over a minute of new strats and new, route, new routes in 112. So you, you can't really compare the levels of execution just because we have like a superior kind of uh, superior material to work with. Oh yeah, I'm grinding pantheons non-stop. <laughs> Lost in the fluke manga sauce, yes. Oh, look at the time loss though. <laughs> Oh yeah, they always do the Chisinator. They add uh, DLC stuff so fucking organically. I love Team Cherry. Like their world building uh, and th this like kind of lore stuff is, is top notch. Okay, Pantheons, look at that. Look at what I, I just I just moved to the left and kind of debated this bench fly. Oh my god, dude, just give me a break. <laughs> One tiny mistake. I moved to the left by like fucking three pixels. <laughs> Blue be like, yeah, it's not at 312. <laughs> Chat, I'm so fucking tired. Look at the wiggles though. I'm redeeming myself. Unfortunately, I don't have soul. 314.57, thanks, water. <laughs> I like, I lost 10 seconds and then saved 5 instantly. Uh, one, <laughs> yeah. Uh, 112 fights, pure vessel in absolute radiance. <clears throat> Let's see if. My Pantheon practice pays off, though. <clears throat> Interesting um, damage boost. Yeah, you, you can you can see me. I'm doing very sloppy fights because I'm really tired. I'm actually not nervous in first Pantheons. <laughs> what the fuck am I doing here? Dude. Like, what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, losing time so far. <clears throat> I'm at 7 seconds minus.
Oh, got hit. And you see, I'm, I turned around, and I, I know he was like couple couple hits away. That, that's that's fine, Gorp. Yeah. <laughs> 320 Pantheons here. Yep. At least I didn't miss uh, Dan Defender Scream Skips. <laughs> oh, look at these dashes through. That's like Sh Shade Cloak didn't refresh. That was fast, that was very fast uh, Soul Warrior. Not gold, but... Good one. Also blue. Look at this Moloch. That'll be like one hit Moloch, I think. Look at that. Because he's tough. And he's also dead. <laughs> you see, I'm climbing back. I lost 10 seconds on uh, Vegfly King, but I'm, I'm getting it back. Worst RNG right away. Nice start. Another kind of bad one. You see, I'm getting the worst possible pattern here on these guys. This is just nothing you can do about it. Just kind of damage tank through it. And don't get hit too much. Yeah. <laughs> I played it well though. Like, I think I got a very, very nice fight out of this RNG. Don't look at the golds here. My golds here suck. Like, my PB goals are so much better. My, my IL goals are so much better. <laughs> nice, I missed like a door. <laughs> Wait, this P1 kind of sucks. Slower loads. Um, I don't know. Oh, oh, I split at different points, Blue. Uh, my Nail Master split. See what I did here. See what I did here. I I thought I'm on the Gore Barina. And I went on the right and I kinda fucked up entire fight. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, my, my loads are very fast. It's just um, my my brothers like uh, split later. I don't know why. For some reason. Oh, it may be, maybe blue, blue, blue. Maybe it's 1.5 difference in splits, because I've noticed today that your nail master splits fucking fast, and mine splits slower. I think this is the reason. I think my uh, zero is. I think my P2 is gonna be faster because of that. Yeah, yeah. I've noticed today that your P1 like split right away, and I have to wait for the ending cutscene. Probably that's why. Also, hey, Pest, hello. Look at this fucking cycle. I, I held up accidentally. <laughs> and because of that, I'm fucking this up. <laughs> Still kinda killed him. <laughs> yeah, 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 it just uh, counts, uh, counts slower, I think. Probably. It, it, I, I think so, at least. We'll see. We'll see what P2 will bring us. You see, I'm kind of waiting, I'm not rushing it. Look at how I, how fast I, how quick I killed him. So far, uh, the only major mistake on Polo 2, on Pantheon 2 is 0. I fucked up 0 because I thought it's Gorp. I don't know why I suck, actually. But I've noticed that blue Snail Masters split way too fast today. That was a nice trick, that was a very good trick. Damn, look at the strats. Look at the gold, that was actually nice. Uh, and I decided to get more soul from Armo. Just one more spell.
<laughs> Marmo is always bad, but thanks god I had an extra spell. Uh, I think it's like um, a variable in the data class, player data, something like that. Can I just wait for uh, for Ross here? Yeah, dead. Oh, do you split that Pantheon one completed blue? I split that uh, Oro and Mato. Oh, by the way, this is the strat that you fucked up today. And it's kind of harder to do without steady buy, you know. <laughs> I'm sorry. Look at the up slashes. Look at the up slashes. You don't need steady buy. You can just do this. Just stay closer to the boss. Look at the strats. I'm saving time. I'm saving the time back. I'm already net positive. I'm already net positive on that. I ended like minus two twenty or something. This is a good. Uh, this is a good uh, P two. Yeah, kind of fucked this up though. <laughs> what the fuck is this shield? This is like so bad. Okay, I redeem myself. No, I don't. <laughs> yeah, this is bad. That was bad. Uh, it, it, like, I, I fucked up the first and the last boss of P2, but everything else was good. So overall, I saved time, chat. You see? You see? I'm losing big amounts of time on single bosses, on like uh, singular bosses, but overall, this is a time save. Hey, Tira. Hello? Tira Kura. Hello. Welcome. I see more North American people, which means that I'm an absolute degen. <laughs> it's 3.30 in the morning for me. Hey, Kepler's, you are no, wrong. <laughs> I have all the time safe in uh, P3 against my OPB. You see, we're doing like an up slashes. Oh, that was so good. Like, that that was amazing fight. Hey, Cactus, what's up? Beat the Simo. <laughs> Bad Elder Horinji. Unlucky. But my PP had one Pancakes uh, too. And he, you see, he doesn't uh, teleport that much. So, one Pancake, but overall that was a good pattern. So, it's a gold. And a scream skip. Somebody has to learn that. Wow, five brain. Seriously. That was kind of sloppy collector. <laughs> oh yeah, it's, uh, it's uh, pre-recorded. This right strat is so good. It's starting with the great slash. It's a big DPS. That was like questionable shriek, but you know, still take those. That was a, that, that was actually very good. God tamer, unironically very good. <laughs> and I didn't even gold it. <laughs> Oh my, oh my fucking god, yes, this is... <laughs> I missed everything on this fucking guy. I missed like everything, but thanks god I got Grab Song to carry me. Look at this bullshit, guys. <laughs> I don't even say guys normally, I just said it because I didn't know what else to say. I just, uh, I'm just embarrassed. <laughs> like guys is in even it's not even in my vocabulary what the fuck i started learning english when same guys was already cringe and all the annoying youtubers would say it ever <laughs> that's a good galleon
But I'm saving time, that's good. Oh, that was such a... so clutched. I barely got uh, that uh, Dudark. Oh, look at that Pogo, holy shit. That was bad. Shouldn't have that much tank here. He kind of starts being annoyed. You see, I'm missing. Uh, you, he, he's like he's fucking one hit away, but it, it was very bad. Zold. <laughs> uh, hey, Insomnia. Yeah, that's a pace that we have. Look at the time save on Umu. <laughs> Fast attack. That's okay. Not 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 the best RNG, but you know. And. That, that's a good RNG, like that's the second best you can... Well, the, the jelly spawn is not the best you can get, but fast attack into spawn is definitely something we take. So that would be a nice, nice, nice time save. Of, of course not a gold. But, you know, losing 6 seconds, like 7 seconds to Umu is, is huge. I'm not dying to Horner 2 anymore in, in Pantheon, so just see her getting absolutely fucked in the, in the ass. Yeah, stays in the corner, bitch. <clears throat> I'm starting losing my voice. <laughs> oh, look at the uh, look at the slide. I pr I grind the slide. Chat. I went to got home and I grinded this motherfucker for the fucking hour. Look at the dark. The, look at the up slashes. I fucking know how to fight this guy at any amount of HP. He gets fucked. Dead. Not even gold, by the way. So yeah, I saved 20 seconds in P3, that's very nice. You see chat, the practice paying off. Like yeah, I'm super tired, but I've practiced Pantheons so, so bad, so, so like hard that uh, I'm getting, I'm, I'm improving like four hours like into the stream while being tired. I think it was like 3 a.m. as well. <laughs> Meme runners be like. Okay, but my PBP4 was really good though. And mostly because it had really nice RNG. Just like that. Just like that one. Oh, boy, you submitted run. I can actually just verify it. I've watched almost the entire thing. Unless Jenker does it. Uh, unless Jenker does it first. This guy just fucking annoying. I'm not even playing him badly, he, he's just kind of... He's just being an ass. <laughs> Absolutely gagged. Look at this no eyes. I fucking hate no eyes. No eyes destroyed my whole existence in this round. Oh my god. Teleport. And she teleports like in, in the worst post- like- oh my god, no eyes. Such a bad teleport. Oh, dodged the ghost. I played kinda well. <laughs> Not in a blush way, I don't believe you, Aaron. I don't believe you. This chat is too horny for that. <laughs> Thanks, Jax. <laughs> By the way, I got the scream skip. Oh, Blue, by the way, to get the Scream Skip, you side slash the Traitor Lord before dashing. Oh, never mind. You have a uh, steady body. It won't work for you. Yeah, shout out to Overworld, no eyes. Yeah, side slash should just get some nice, nice knockback to good Scream Skip. No eyes really fucked me this round, man. We'll see what uh, P5 we're gonna give me. 
<laughs> Mathulu, yeah, I mean, maybe I will die to Obsidian Fragrance. And entire community will gonna hate me for the clickbait. <laughs> nice prediction, Water. I like how, like, at the start of the run, people kinda predicted 314, you know? Some, like, carefully were, were like, maybe 313. <laughs> Wow, bitter, bitter thing, I will like choke 3 minutes in Pantheons. <laughs> Look at how I, I just kill this guy. To P5 grass. Yeah, th there was 313 in the beginning for sure. But people definitely be way, way less optimistic about the run. <laughs> nice one, Shresh. Ah, Markoth went up. Actually, my Markoth P4 strat sucks. I need to do more Nail Slashes at the beginning. Can I do what Blue does and Monster? Where they stay really close and slash... This is, I kinda got lucky, he got stuck. Oh, Birdie, hey, thanks for the raid. Appreciate it. We're at the end of the floor on a sick pace. On my best pace ever. Welcome, welcome, Raiders. Hi, everyone. Hey, Marcy, hello. Marcy, the well-known Hollow Knight glitch hunter. The person who dropped the world record in by fucking half. Shout out. <laughs> and Marcy is the reincarnation of Savi. Like, boomers and glitched runners know Savvy, so Mars is like the like proper reincarnation. <laughs> Look at this uh, Watcher Nice, by the way. This is like a fucking embodiment of better engine Watchers. <laughs> this is like an embodiment. That was so bad. Like, rolls all the way. Still time saver. <laughs> Also, look at the strats here. Look at the strats. I'm not missing anything. I'm staying in the middle and he gets fucked. And have you seen that dash slash? Yeah. Again, I got, got, got screwed here. I mean, I screwed it myself. That was a good tire. I played really well here. And I really played. Nice. Nice goal. Will I die to pure vessel again? Or will I get a hitless? You see, I'm playing kinda safe. Like it's it's kind of bad pattern. This is a bad decision to do this, yes, because I'm getting hit since he gonna get staggered out of Shriek. But it, it was fine. Look at the Paris. Oh, the clutch dive. That's fine. This hit was very fine. I know that he's like about to die, so I, I go ham. I know that he's like basically dead. And yeah, I'm tired. I'm kind of already nervous. And I'm still kind of getting a good times. Net, so so far I saved like what? I saved 30, 34 seconds on my Pantheons already. 34 seconds already saved. Very good. Very, very, very good. Um, but I like the how my P4 basically stayed the same. 24? No. 34. Wait. 20. Yes, 24. Fuck. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's fucking 4 a.m. <laughs> okay, going into P5. With best pace possible is faster than world record by almost a minute. <laughs> Chat, 
If I stay within 50 seconds of my gold, I can world record this run. Any hype train? Wink wink. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, if you know anything about P5 in 112, you will lose 2 minutes here, at, at least. You'll fucking lose 2 minutes here to your summer best. At least 2 minutes. Yes, Purity, thanks <laughs> for noticing my failed C-dash. <laughs> Jenker! I... I was joking, okay? But thanks for the sub to play in Bread Mike. Nice name, by the way. Look at this, the, the Grass Mother strats. And I guess pattern. I kinda played it decently. <laughs> Thank you for your generosity, Jenker. Yeah, he gets fucked. Generosity, yes. That was totally intentional. Ta -ta 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 -ta. He jumped, no! Okay, middle RNG, like, mediocre RNG. <laughs> no, they die. I didn't get hit by Hornet chat. I'm learning from my mistakes from P1. Oh, look at the clutched uh, side slash. That's basically what Nightmare did in, in uh, the RPG. Yo, must be what the fuck. POG gameplay trackout. Valik 0 POG GRS Valik 0 drunk. This text to speech. <laughs> Five brain, thanks for that. Oh shit, we have a hype train already. Damn, it's so easy to get a hype train on my stream. <laughs> I'm so bad at selling out. But yeah, thanks a lot. Thanks thanks very much, uh, Jenker, Firebrain, and NSB. Really appreciate it. POG, Gamma Fly, <laughs> Strach Out. And yeah, shout out to Nightmare. I've learned a fuck ton from Nightmare, who is like Chinese Pantheon God. So basically, I'm stalling strats. Uh, I'm stealing strats for Monster, Nightmare, Black Moon, and uh, doing some of my own. And so far, we're, we're we're doing really good. I'm saving time. Very good. Still, uh, three ten possible best possible time. By the way, <laughs> this guy kind of a dick, but I'm playing it sort of well. You see, up slashes, very nice. I got hit and I've used it to my uh, to my advantage. Got a bit impatient, started up slashing here. I shouldn't have done it, so that was a mistake. I <laughs> lied about not being a world record. I mean, yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. There's no way you can play within 50 seconds of your gold in P5 unless you gold a lot. <laughs> Look at this play. I play this pattern like a god. Unfortunately, I kind of fucked up the dream nails here, so you see. Yeah, I didn't get my final dream nail. So, this is like a mediocre engine, not the best one, but it's good. Riggs! Thanks for gifting us up to spirit. <coughs> nice D Dark. Kinda missed the shriek though, so. But, but still good. And I'm skipping the bench. Will I redeem my zero? Chat, will I redeem my zero? I fucked up zero in P2 because I thought it's Gorp. <laughs> I, st I, I'm, I started with Gorp strats on zero on P2. Uh, I mean, kind of... Yeah, I kind of fucked it up though. <laughs> Not entirely, but could have been better. By the way, I've added new emotes today. A couple of them are even animated. Let's go. I, I feel so bad for selling out. I don't know. I just 
don't know what I feel about it, but yeah. Thanks, thank, thank you everyone for the support, I guess. <laughs> um, the drunk emote is so good. Look at this pattern. Okay, can I do like a fucking great slash at the beginning? <laughs> oh yeah, Firebrand, I'm actually your founder. <laughs> Look at these strats, oh yeah. Oh yeah, he gets fucked. I mean, I, I would have killed him faster, but, but still, you, you get the showcase. Yeah, first phase was like almost as fast as it gets. It can still be faster fast. My IL gold, uh, my IL gold is 36, and this was 39. But yeah, it was almost as good as it gets. This is kind of a bad pattern because they kind of stay on top. And I didn't have enough soul to kill them both, but I, I kind of played it well. Well, I should have went for the right trick at the second one, so I guess a couple mistakes still, but it's fine. <laughs> Look at the strats. Look at the dash strat. One, two, three, four. Four hits on the dash. And here I kind of missed nail art, but it would have been five with the nail art. This strat I stole from Black Moon. This like dash along in into fourth hit. It adds so much DPS. You like. Look at those shrieks, man. I'm playing this so fucking well. Damage tank, this is fine. I was preparing for that. I'm just clutching this like out. I, I realized that I need to go more for shrieks here. This damage is fine. You, you won't get more hits anyway. Just look at that. That was beautiful. That was such a good fight. I actually popped off on this fight. It's not sub 1, like my IL gold go my IL gold is sub uh, sub 1, but this was still very good. Very very close. And I skipped the bench because you know why not. Like in hindsight, skipping that bench was kind of a mistake. Because I need I ended up needing HP, I think. Look at the strats. It's basically the same as Teddy Body strats, but you kind of tap left, tap right a little bit after side slash. And we're minus three. <laughs> he kind of jumped backwards, but still good. Yeah, just stagger him as fast as you can. That, that kind of this pattern is bad. Shriek, of course. Yes, when he jumps into the final headbang, you do shriek because why not? Yeah, he, he gets fucked. Like, yeah, just dead. You see, I I beat him after he died. That's like a fucking teabagging of Hollow Knight, I tell you. But it's okay because it's not multiplayer. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm getting a bit toxic <laughs> to enemies that I beat offline. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, I'm playing really well right now. I'm, I'm, go I'm, go I'm going great. Thank you. <laughs> if I play within uh, 18 seconds, it is gonna be world record. Give me another hype train, guys. <laughs> I mean, my goals kinda suck. <laughs> Water. It's way slower than my IL goals because my ILs are way more optimized than my PB. <laughs> Janker, thanks for the sub. Again. <laughs> one sub, one time save. <laughs> nice. Yes, I'm doing great slash. Uh, not into Pogwin, into up slashes. Um, I don't like Pogwin. Mm, Pogwin uh, Galleon, not my favorite. I'm kind of like, yeah, that, that was a good fight, like that was a decent fight, one pancake is, is whatever. Because if he goes down, you, you lose a lot of time and you will have to do D-Dark. Nice collector, by the way. Look at this RNG. 
This is like such a good RNG. If only he didn't go into the ceiling, he would have been dead. So it's not like a god RNG, but it's a very good one. And look at the time save, chat. Look at the fucking time save. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> oh my god. Best possible time still underworld record copium. I'm gonna get it. I just need to play within five seconds. <laughs> Nah, this is not gonna break it, don't worry about it. Oh, that, those parry was super slow. <laughs> yeah, like anybody who knows anything about P5 knows that it's not gonna world record. <laughs> but I appreciate the enthusiasm. It's still a very good P5 so far. <laughs> Yes, uh, save the minute in Pantheon so far. <laughs> okay, will Watcher Knights fuck me up? Good RNG so far. That was kinda bad, but good the dark. Oh, the back roll! But it's fine. Back roll here is fine. Back roll is way better than roll because it's short. It didn't matter in the end. That was good. Triple. They kind of like they. It's it's like a very bad RNG, but I'm playing it decently. I'm uh, I I've got a couple like I got hit a couple times. Another roll. Yeah, this is like this is very bad. Like for Butcher Knight's RNG, this is really really bad. This sucks. It loses a lot of time. You see already time loss, so it's like 6 seconds, I think. Yep, 6 seconds. Like, nothing you can really do about that RNG. What's he? What Umu? World record dead! Oh no! Okay, fast attack. <laughs> Reset. Two fast attacks, it's like 12 seconds. 12 seconds to best pattern. And spawn, spawn kinda sucks to be honest, you have to do this, yeah, it's very awkward. You have to wait because you don't have steady bag. So yeah, it's like 10 or 12 seconds to to gold. My gold here is 24 and optimal umu is 21, I think. Yet 12 seconds. Well, <laughs> lost 10 seconds back. Just like just like that. Just like boop. umu moment. Look at the flying mosque strats. Oh, this dash into shade soul. Get fucked. Thanks for the hundred. W Arkan Birivivet. Chat for the low low price way. <laughs> yeah, that was nice shrieks. I decided to wait here. I could have killed him, yeah, I knew he will die, but I decided to wait just for safety. You don't really want to tank damage here. And I know that this will be a big time save on most because I fucked it up on my PB. And we are back at minus three <coughs> three twenty. Look at this, look at the Sly, Sly, I, I fucking, oh my god, I'm staying so close to him. That's, that's how Sly should look. Thanks for the 100 Rusty, points. Matu, you, matu, Dead. Fuck you. My Sly became so good. I grinded this bitch two fucking hours and got home. I lost my mind there. But I think I, I got the strats now. And I'm not dying to Hornet 2. I'm not dying to Hornet 2 anymore. Get fucked, bitch. <laughs> ah, missed two hits. No, and Stagger Count got reset. And uh, yeah, I just had to do one mistake, you know, chat. I just had to do one for, for the fans. <laughs> yeah, lost a bit of time. And uh, uh, on the other hand, I can do the bench skip. This is very good. <laughs> oh, that one nail hit was so clutched. The pre last one. Look at.
Look at the jumps, chat. <laughs> that was questionable, Pogo, not gonna lie. I thought he will get staggered. Like this. That was nice. Here I kinda missed Nap Slash. Uh, here I should have done Pogo into the dark, so I'm doing like mistakes here. So it, it was fine, like, I, I, I'm, I'm definitely done some mistakes, but unfortunately lost time, yeah, yeah. What they even said here? Look at this no ice though. Good start, right? Teleport, got fucked by ghosts, and she's just staying there. Nice teleport into spikes. <laughs> Another ghost hit, almost got... <laughs> Worst possible spawn. Got fucked. <laughs> Another worst possible spawns into ghost. Chat, I'm dying here. Yeah, that was no ice just fucked me this round, chat. Look at the time loss. I lost 13 14 seconds to no ice. No ice, yeah, slightly smiling face. I think I collectively lost like a fucking minute to no ice this round. Not gonna lie, I started feeling nerves again after this no ice fight. It, it was, you know, it was a reality check, but oh my god, you can get fucked easily here. Don't, don't, like, take it easy, man. Unfortunately, like, 111 is dead for, for good. It's, it's like that for sure. Yeah, got fucked by no eyes. Will this guy work? Good start so far. That, that dash was, wasn't necessary. I should, but, like, this is nerves. Nerves are getting to me again. <laughs> Except no eyes. Yeah, no eyes is the bane of my existence. Well, we'll see, we'll see. <laughs> yeah, 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 this is just nerves. I'm, I'm doing mistakes because I'm nervous here. But this is like, you need to get your shake under control. Like, okay, it's not minus 320, but whatever. You know, like, this run is not world record pace. It's kind of, I just telling myself, like, this is not world record, just chill, you know, like, take it easy, don't die, this is, this is gonna be, like, good PD no matter what, no matter what happens, like, this is gonna be sick. Look at the hits, though. That was bad. That was good dash. Yeah, that like this dash into up slash was very good. Like that was that was a good execution on Soul Tyrant. That was a really good execution. Well, apart from that one, but it still loses time because RNG matters a lot on this fight. You see, I'm still losing time even though the execution was pretty decent. Look at the market though. That's such a big mistake, dude. And I and I, I never do this. I just went too early. And he went up, but went up in a very awkward way. You see I'm playing safer. Good ending, good ending, but I fucked up in the beginning and my PB market was very good, so I'm losing five more seconds here. And we are already minus 247. The choke. Well, I mean it's not really the choke, it's like mistake that loses you five seconds, but it's not big. But it, it still hurts mentality. It's like, oh my god, oh my god, I'm losing control. And Zoe decides that he will gonna fucking jump all, 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 all around. You see? I'm playing it all right though. Like, I'm not, I'm not freaking out or anything. I'm, I'm trying to stay disciplined. Hey, cry, thanks. <laughs> it's definitely like it's pre-recorded, just, just, just in case. It's a, it's a reflection. So you, you see, I played it well. I, I kind of chilled. At this point, I'm not nervous anymore. I, I got myself under control. But still lost time. It's mostly like a RNG time loss. I lost 40 seconds. Oh, almost 40 seconds already. <laughs> yeah, P, P4 gauntlet is absolutely brutal like that. Like, n n no eyes, uh, white defender, soul tyrant. Oh, oh, have to, have to dodge. Because, yeah, I fucked up a couple nail hits <coughs> and got punished for it. This is okay, though. 
Here, you see, I'm, I tried to heal the second time because I'm, I'm tired. This is just tiredness mistake. And I missed one dream nail because of that. So you see, I'm one soul less than I want to be. Because I wanted to heal the second time. So, so this is like genuine tired mistake. This is kind of like the point where you start losing your focus because you've just been running for so long. This is like reasonable pattern. I missed an upslash here. And so I missed two hits here on this rotation. This is bad. And here I, I'm, I chickened out. I, I, I had to go for the, another shriek, but I chickened out. And you see what I did? This is a huge mistake. I didn't stagger him. This is huge. This is very huge. Now I'm one shriek less of a DPS and lost time on stagger, so no soul. And I decided to heal. Why did I heal? This is just a little panic mode after a mistake. Like, okay, I, I'm not gonna, like, at this point, I'm just sucking the time loss, sucking in the time loss. I'm not in danger of dying. I just kind of decided to suck the time loss in. I could have, I could have risked it. Because you see he's dead, he's dead. But uh, mentally, I just fuck this shit. I'm gonna lose the time. You see 23 seconds to some of best. Is 312 dead? So this is pure mentality situation. I knew his HP in my head, but I still decided to chicken out. But it was good for my sanity because I know that I'm playing shaky and that I can't trust myself with optimal strats. So th that was fine. That was okay. At least I was never, I was never, uh, I was never, you know, at one HP. <laughs> that was nice up slash. I didn't expect him to uh, stagger here. Oh, the clutch again. I'm playing well. Like, not gonna lie. Like, for the for the shakiness, I'm playing really well. I already got my shit together. So that stuff on NKG, that was a genuine mistake. I wasn't really like nervous. I just, I just, I just did mistake. You know, chat. This happens. Like, you're gonna do mistakes, and you have to react accordingly. You just have to make a decision. Yeah, this is a time loss. 312. <laughs> is this still 312 or not? <coughs> so, my actual absolute radiance gold is 146. My gold in PB is 10 seconds slower than my actual gold. And my PB time is 4 seconds slower. So, my PB time is uh, 14 seconds slower than my IL gold. Which is actually within the time loss. Like losing 14 seconds on Abstract is nothing is nothing out of this world. Abstract is more or less, you know, give or take 15 seconds. Regardless how how like uh, how ham you go on it. Yeah, and world record has finished now. You see? Like, this is like a place where World Record has like a huge hype train going, like Jenker getting like 30 subs or something. <laughs> I, I just know that because I like rewatched it, re it recently. Look at this second phase, look at this second phase, it was, this was the perfect second phase. It, it was as good as it gets. This was like the gold. I'm kind of choking it a little bit, but it's fine. I have 5 HP and I'm very confident in this climb. I can, you see, I can just do the safe strats. <laughs> yeah, GG's. There you go. And if you know anything about Absurd, this is gonna 312. Like, you can see at the time of the final hit, and you know that it's gonna 312. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so, chat, I lost 40 seconds in the P4 Gauntlet. But my net time save, but I still saved time in... So I lost 40 seconds on like 4 bosses in P4. But I still saved time overall in God Hole. <laughs> yeah, thanks everyone for the GG's, appreciate it, appreciate it a lot. Yo, 3 Unicorn Geeks. Oh shit, that's a lot of beats. Uh, it's hard to count, but... 53, yeah, thanks a lot, points. Appreciate it. So yeah, we have a 312. I... Chat, 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 wait, wait, wait. Thanks, Lord, for 312. This is 
world's first 312. How about that? World's first. Yes. <laughs> Thanks for the beats, cap points. Here for goofing the last one, not like this. For goofing the last one. <laughs> uh, appreciate it, cap points. Appreciate it a lot. Yeah, it, this is uh, world's first 312 because monster skipped it and went to 311 right away. <laughs> By the way, I skipped 314 and I skipped 312, uh, 313. Oh, I've never seen the 313. GG yeah. Thanks, Drew. Appreciate the beats. Appreciate it a lot. Okay, chat, let's go through the redeems, through the predictions. While we're at, um, while we're at it. Good thing that Sima failed Kappa. Sima failed. <laughs> never seen a 313 and I never fucking will. That's right. <laughs> no, this is not world record. This is one minute and 20 something seconds of world record. So, um, you know what, chat? I think my next stream will be like, we'll have like world record attempts or something. I need to sell out. <laughs> hey, Crispy, thanks for the sub. Thank yes, you will up. see a 313. <laughs> Thanks, Jenker. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure since I'm finishing no resets, uh, of course, at some point I finish a 313. That's behind. Aaron, thanks for the sub. Uh, you're so generous, people. You don't have to, but thank you a lot. Okay. Viewer rewards, channel points, uh, manage rewards and challenge. Uh, Where's that? Review, review request queue. Okay. So yeah. <laughs> Holy shit, Slorent. Thanks for the five. Damn. Grad, Cronster, Quack, Zui, and Violet. Enjoy your emotes. Rix, thanks for 312. <laughs> okay, 